Hi, Kim. Can we get some meals? You're the first one here today. Rare. Hi, man. Can we get some meals? Wait. You guys came in together? That's sus. <laughs> Hi, guys. I got post notes on. Wait, what does that mean? Sus? Yeah. Hi, Wheel. Can we get some yos? Hello. Oh, on Twitter. I thought you meant, like, the notepad app. I was like, why do you have your notepad open? Like... <laughs> anyway. Guys, new YouTube video. It's in the pin chat. I'll put it in the chat log for the VOD watchers. Click the link. I tried, quote-unquote, drinking and driving the Mario Kart. Watch it later. Banger vid. Hi, Vic. Can we get some yos? Hello. Also, Vic, I sent your sketch card in the mail this morning. Hopefully, it'll arrive by next Thursday. Why are there so many chatters? What is going on? Did you guys miss me or something? Or maybe it's Saturday. I usually don't stream on Saturdays. Of course we did, you sucker! <laughs> also, Mac, uh, yesterday, sub only, we finished planning the birthday stream. We're not gonna talk about it, like, ever again until the actual birthday. So if you could, DM me your list, and I'll look at it later. I have a whole plot planned. Thank you, Mac. I'm ignoring all my homework due today. Kim! You're in big trouble. What if I just time you out? Kim, what if I time you out for like 12 hours and then you have to do your homework? And I'll untime you out when you finish your homework. Remember when I used to do it? Are you sure? I'll do it. I'm not memeing. I'll do it. I'll do it. Wait, how many seconds is 12 hours? Ah, oh, shit. I gotta do the math. I'll do it. And then, Mac, tell me when Kim's done with her stupid homework. Let's see, calculator, 60 seconds times 60 minutes times 12. That's 43,204 hours? Okay, I'll time you out for four hours. You guys are so weird begging for timeouts. <laughs> okay, let's, let's do the math. 60 seconds times 60 minutes times four. 14,000 seconds. Did I do it? Wait, it didn't work. It didn't work. What the hell? <laughs> Wait, it didn't work. There it is. <laughs> See you in four hours, Kim. <laughs> I figured it out. I put the wrong thing. Yeah, R.I.P. King. Get your stupid homework done. Dude, there were so many days where I would stream and not do my homework, and then I would fail the class. Looking back, not worth it. Because I, I had to t retake a good handful of my classes. I think in my whole... Like, college career, I had to take six classes again, mainly because, like, I didn't- ju I just didn't want to do the homework. And that cost me, like, literally, like, $2,000 per class to retake, so that's, like, an extra 12k that I lost. Or just not go? I think, genuinely, if I did, like, in-person classes for college, I would have been more, like, into it. Because I did fully online, I did online pre-pandemic, too, so, like, if I had somewhere physically to go, I would I would force myself to go. Mainly because I would be so scared of like my parents finding out about me skipping school, even though the strat is if we have any zoomers. The strat is make your emergency contact number your own cell phone number. That way if like your principal or your teacher calls you, they just call you. <laughs> and then you just pretend to be your mom or some shit. 
Oh, I'm sorry, Mag. I hope we're doing better now. Wait, somebody got auto modded. <gasps> Kim called me a sucker. That's so mean. She deserved that timeout. Okay, wait, Kim, you better keep the stream open though. Mac, make sure she has the stream open. I'm almost done. I got my graduation letter. Yo, let's go. Because you said you're graduating this summer, right? With a stupid STEM degree. Actual, actual smart shit. Okay. It's not dope. I'm just jealous. My science degree is technically not science. <laughs> okay. Let's see. It is Sunday, April 6th, 11.05 a.m. I'm right on time today. Not too early, not too late. I click live right at 11. So. Oh, I'm so zoomed in. Also, my chair is too low. I adjust my chair whenever I edit. Because when I edit, I sit like this. At my computer. So I have to like put my chair down really low. Talking about editing. Guys, new YouTube video. Click the link. Go watch it later. It's an edit of this- oops, wrong command. It's an edit of the St. Patrick's Day stream. I tried drinking and driving a Mario Kart. Click the link, go watch it later. What else? Also, there's a new 7 TV emote. They finally added it. I see it in Ludwig's chat all the time. It's blah, 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 blah. <laughs> Zoomed in because Zoomer? Now, I want you guys to see these shiners. This is why I didn't have my face cam on yesterday, because... Dude, I've, I've gotten so good about, like, not touching my face and not, like, picking at my acne. I've gotten so good, but yesterday, I cracked. I woke up and went, Ch -ch -ch. I was like, oh, I got a hit. So, like, it was bad. My face was really bloody yesterday. Like, thankfully, they're closed up now, and I put ointment on this morning, too, but... You guys do not want to see it yesterday. But, guys... You know what time it is. It is peace lock time. Stop the music. That's what I say when I first see your mom. I'm deleting that one. I don't I don't want to see oh I got a hit in the chat room. I don't want to see that. <laughs> Dude, I just started stream. Can we not babe? It was funny. I just don't want it in the chat. <laughs> Wait. Wait, is- wait, I need to see if that's a black term. <laughs> wait. Okay, adding, let me hit. I got a hit. <laughs> As block- wait, it's on screen! <laughs> we have two new block terms. She hates AAV- oh my god, let's not start this. I- stop! Peace lock 2024, guys. I don't- I don't want to get canceled yet, okay? I'm not even popular enough to deserve canceling. Oh my god, hi Luigi. Can we get some yo's? Hello. Okay, it's so weird without music. Everybody say, hi YouTube. <laughs> Good job, Meg. I remember that moment. Everybody say, hi YouTube. I will edit this down in like a million years because it's so many hours of footage. Okay. It is day 12, technically day 13 of the Peace Lock 2024. Last time, we got to Fortree City after nearly five, six hours of constantly battling and encounters, but I got a lot of new Pokemon. So today, we're going to be focusing on exploring Fortree City, getting ready for the sixth gym since it's in the Jungle City. My assumption is that this gym will be Grass Pokemon. So yesterday, or not yesterday, so the last time I was leveling up my Torkoal, so let's see if I made the right decision. Okay, that is the plan for today. Also, if you subscribe, you can kill my Pokemon. And why? Why is Brendan on this screen? I don't want Brendan. And I yes, I did remember to charge my GBA last night. Okay. And we're in. Forty-seven hours, <laughs> dude. And we're in. 
Timer started. Four Tree City. So I haven't explored anything in the city. Last time, I just went to the Pokemon Center, healed up, and then ended stream. So today we're going to explore a little bit. This town, honestly, super cool. I love plants. I love green. Yeah, I told Kim to keep this stream open. She's in trouble. She needs to, like, make it up to me now. I started replaying Emerald and got a shiny Torchic after 30 minutes. Wait, so that- for those runs, you have to, like, restart the game, right? That's crazy. But you know what? I have a Blaziken, so I'm much further than you, Wheel. Let's check out the treehouse. I like the music in this town, too. Trading Pokemon with others. Oh my god, tell me you have an Abra. It's as if you're trading your own memories with other people. Oh. I really want to get Kadabra back. <clears throat> Roar, I need it. I have to get me a Volbeat. I'll do anything for it. Um, did you hear that? My shout from the bottom of my heart? Having heard that, you'll trade your Volbeat for my Plusle. Won't you? No! No, Volbeat was like super rare. And I have a Plusle. I will not do that. <laughs> I don't even have a Volbeat anyway. No, you won't trade me? Even after I bared my heart to you? No, oh, that's such a horrible trade. For a Plusle? I'm not gonna lie, those Pokemon are both kinda shit, but... Shit is still shit. The city consists of homes built on trees. Perhaps because of that lifestyle, everyone is healthy and lively. Why, even myself, I feel as if I've grown 30 years younger. Dude, I would die in the city. I would topple down the ladder. <laughs> okay, let's check out the shop. A rare candy makes a Pokemon grow immediately by one level. Sick fact. Super Opel lasts a long time, and it gets the job done. It's much better than an ordinary Opel. I only stock up on more items than I'm sure I'll need. You never know what might happen. Better to be safe than sorry. Okay, true. I hope now I get better Pokeballs. Great. Ultra Balls, Super Potion, Hyper Potion, Antidote, Paralyze Heal, Awakening, Revive, Super Repel, Wood Mail. I'll buy a mail. No, I'm out of space! Okay. Um. I'll buy four Hyper Potions just to, like, have them. The old man's thinking, we aren't on our phones in this city. All those blasted Pokedabs, their kids looking at it all day long. Because I don't think, like, cell phones were accessible at this time. I'm trying to find my revive, that way I can sell it. I have no need for such rubbish. We continue on. There are Pokemon that evolve when you trade them. That's what I heard. Oh. Wait. I know that's a function, which I think is such a dumb function. But does that mean my C dot's not gonna evolve? Because earlier. No, wait, no, routes evolved. I don't know. Living on top of trees is okay, but sometimes bug Pokemon come in through windows. It can be really startling. See, that's finally form is a stone evolution? That makes no sense. It's kind of like the Ninkita. How you evolved into a bug? Wait, no, a flying. Of course he evolved into a bug. <laughs> Pokemon and people have adapted to nature for survival. There's no need to make nature conform to the way we want to live. 
The tree houses of Fortree are great. I think it's the number one town for living together with Pokemon. Oh, there's a path up here. Okay, I didn't see it. Hi, Kobobo. Can we get some yo's? Hello. Also, Kobobo, I mailed out your card this morning. Hopefully, it'll arrive by next Thursday. There's only three Pokemon in Emerald that trade with evolutions only. Okay, well, that's fine. As long as there's none of the Pokemon that I have currently, I don't care. The bridge moves. Oh no. People, Pokemon. Their hidden powers are aroused by living in natural environments. Let this old woman see if your hidden power has awoken. I hold a coin in my hand. Now tell me, have I pumped it? Or Wait, the camera's flipped for you guys. <laughs> this is my left. This is my right. Um, She's trying to tell if I'm psychic. You know what I always say, right is right. Oh, yes. Correct. We shall try again. In which hand have I palmed the coin? The right or left? Now. The typical person would think that she changed hands, but that's what the normal person would think. So I'm the abnormal person. I'm going to say right again. Oh, that's correct. We shall try again. In which hand have I palmed the coin? Okay, so she did do the debate of not switching hands again. Now, a fool would fall for this same trick again. So surely she switched hands this time. So right, I mean left. Oh, splendid! Your hidden power has awoken. Here, take this and awaken the hidden power of your Pokemon. You obtained TM10. Hidden power is a move that changes with the Pokemon. Man, I'm so good. I'm so good at these mind games. Or maybe she just tells you you're right either way. Okay, so I think Hidden Power. I have that for one of my Pokemon anyway. Let's just say that I'm like really good at the game. Or Chance, rather. Oh, Hidden Power up top here. The attack power varies among different Pokemon. I think Lotad had Hidden Power. I don't remember. It. I don't care too much for it, honestly. And if any of my Pokemon aren't able to evolve, it don't matter. I'd rather just... I don't care. <laughs> if it ends up being that way, oh well. Hmm. My wife relies on hidden power to stay awake. She should just take a nap like I do and sleep talk. I can teach your Pokemon to sleep talk instead. Interested? No. Oh, fine, fine. You want to stay awake with hidden power, too. Yeah, I was gonna say, it's really, like, remarkable that the elderly are able to live in the canopies. You know, I wouldn't be able to live in them. But the guy down here was like, Oh, years living in the trees keep me young and strong you know i bet if the city taxed their citizens more they can make like a escalator <laughs> i almost said an escalate but that's a car maybe that's why this place is so fertile what does fertile mean what what while well, speaking about pokedexes i remembered something I met this trainer, Steven, when I was searching for rare stones. Oh boy, he had some amazing Pokemon with him. They weren't just rare, they were trained to terrifying extremes. He might even be stronger than the gym leader in this town. 
Okay, so there's a rando who's really powerful. What's that thing you have there? Oh, it's called a Pokedex. It's really awesome. Okay, don't cop it. <laughs> As in people fall down and help the plant life? You mean they die? I don't know if that's any better than saying fertile. What the hell? <laughs> Dude, wheel just digging... Digging themselves deeper and deeper in the hole. Wait, I, I can't advance. Something unseeable is in the way. What? Don't give me a hint, Shirley. No one believes me, but I saw this gigantic Pokemon in the sky. It seemed to squirm as it flew toward Route 131. By the way, you, uh, smell singed. Were you at a volcano or something? Why is he sniffing me, guys? Another playground man? Get him. Do I own binoculars like IRL? Um, no, but I can probably get some. You got a bit plan, don't you? <laughs> My sister probably has a pair, actually, because she has, like, a whole bunch of trinkets for whenever she goes traveling. Like, <laughs> they did this one cave, like, expedition in Japan, so she brought, like, this lantern. <laughs> So she had to carry the lantern with her the whole trip. I thought you had binoculars for Pokemon's death? Wait, go Bubba, you mean- <laughs> Wait, you mean- You mean these? You mean these? Those were cardboard tubes! <laughs> I do Mew. There, go bird Pokemon! I thought he was gonna attack me. <laughs> I asked my Wingle to run an errand for me. I remember the emo. It was literally cardboard too. <laughs> By being together with Pokemon, people make more and more friends. And that brings the world closer together. I think it's wonderful. Man, was the Pokesnap stream at my parents' house? It feels like recent, but also so far away. I think it was at my parents' house. I think it's nice that my sister and I moved, like, at the very end of 22. Because that way I can remember, oh, 2023, I've been moved out. I want to go to the Pokemon gym, but there's something blocking the way. After all the bother, I went through trading on Route 120. There's gotta be a TM that I can learn. Something invisible. Maybe it's a ghost! The ground absorbs rainwater and trees grow by drinking that water. Our four tree city exists because there's both water and soil. Okay, that's like fourth grade. <laughs> That's like first grade education. I think it's so funny whenever you see the zoomers on TikTok, like mesmerized by mirrors, and it's like, you should have learned that shit in like second grade, like at the latest. The kids need to like pay attention in school. Oh, hello. Merchandise you buy here is sent to your own PC. That's fantastic. I wish they could also deliver me home like that. I'm buying a pretty desk and I'm putting my cute dolls on it. If I don't, when I decorate my secret base, my dolls will get dirty or poked with splinters. Small desk. Okay, I don't- I'll be honest, I don't care about decorations and games, like, at all. I'm too focused on, like, leveling, grinding, the actual plot. I don't give a shit about decorations. Okay, I don't need any of that. Lame. Oh! There was another bridge here. Okay. Well... My th 
theory is I can fly to the gym. But I think the Pokemon app just flies you to, like, the city center, not to buildings. I don't know. I'll explore a little bit. Not much in this city. So you got Snazzy, Linus, Cole level 31, Blaziken, Magikarp, and Ralph. What is Magikarp holding? Oh, the money coin. Oh, I forgot what level I need to be at for this gym. Um, for this gym, I need to be level 33, so my Pokemon ideally should be no higher than 35. Route 120. Another invisible wall?! Level 25. So to level up, we'll probably come to this route. Oh, I also didn't see if I caught all the other Pokemon in the previous routes that we explored last time. This should be super effective because Oddish is poison? Yes, sir. Can't be nothing here. This town is full of trickery. Ain't no way. Wait, what? <laughs> Maybe there's something on the ground? Oh yeah. I know it's gotta be a TM. Or an HM. Oh, nobody can fly. <laughs> I'll figure it out later. I don't care. Why am I carrying this parasol? I'll tell you if you can win against me. Parasol Lady Clarissa would like to battle. He sent out Rosalia, level 28. Rosalia is poison grass, so psychic will demolish or confusion. Wait, Ralph is so overleveled. Oopsie. <laughs> I, I still think this gym is grass, so I don't think I'm gonna need to use Ralph anyway. Ralph, go to level 37. Let's go. Parasol Lady Clarissa is about to use the Whalmer. Will I change? Whalmer ha is water, but it has a ground type. Oh, it has a rock type move. Let's bring in Magikarp. Wait, Whalmer has eyes and then two more blowholes up top. He kind of looks like a spider.
But yeah, Magikarp is not a dark type. Okay, how is he landing so many crits? You defeated Parasol Lady Clarissa. A Parasol can ward off Pokemon attacks. You got 2,240 Poke Dollars for winning. I continue on. I'm gonna try and do all the encounters first. Oh, you're peace and hi! Do you remember us from last time? Can you show us how much stronger you've become? Okay, cue interview. Interviewer Gabby and Ty would like to battle. They sent out a Magneton and Loudred. Uh oh, water's weak against electric. Oh <laughs> no. Um, Loudred is normal, and Magneton is weak against fighting, so I'll swap out Magikarp for Blaziken. I think Loudred is gonna be the worst one because he's gonna do the music attack. I only have three stronger Pokemon. I should probably swap out one. How did that one hit KO? Like, I'm only seven levels higher. Oh! <laughs> that did so much. But yeah, Psychic is not strong against Steel, I think it was. You defeated interviewer Gabby and Ty. That was an intense battle. Did you get that all on camera? You got 5,760 Poké Dollars for winning. Easy peasy. A tiny bit. Remember, that's the quote you gave us at the last battle clinch you last time. I never ever forget stuff like that. The last time we battled, you stopped us before we could brace ourselves. Anyway, what do you think? Do you want to be interviewed again? Sure. You will? Thank you. Okay, I need you to describe your feelings about our battle, but it has to be short and sweet. Go. Endings? Confused. <laughs> I'm confused why you keep on losing. Uh huh. Yeah, that's the perfect clincher. I get the feeling that this. Is, I get the feeling that this will make a great TV show. There's a chance that'll that. There's a chance that they'll air this on TV. So make sure to look for us. Okay, we'll be seeing you. A mighty Anna? I know we have sad. Oh, Sackett doesn't work on dark? Magikarp? Possibly. Blaziken? Possibly. But Blaziken doesn't have any offensive moves. Magikarp. Yeah, I know Mr. Mom can make invisible walls. But there's gotta be some type of HM or TM that I have, or that I find, that'll make me see past walls. Because I remember there was the one episode in the anime where Mr. Mime, like, made a whole, like, coliseum of invisible walls.
Bite would not affect him. Dragon Rage does less damage than Twister? I don't want to- I want to try and catch this Mariana. Okay. Bite still affects me. I'm- Okay, I think I'm gonna heal first. Because I'm scared. <laughs> Because now that Magcraft doesn't have tackle, there's like no. He smelled me. <laughs> I have no like low uh, attack. Oh, bite still hurts. Okay, I thought it just didn't affect at all. Nice. Okay, I'll do bite one more time and then we'll do Pokeball. Damn it! I don't need it anyway. I have a Poochiana. God damn it. It's fine. My Pokemon is strong. How about yours? I'm really annoyed. Me taking out another encounter with a crit. Birdkeeper, Ralph. Oh no, Ralph. They sent out a Swablu. <laughs> Level 29. Yep. You defeated Birdkeeper, Robert. Your Pokemon were stronger. You got 1,856 Poké Dollars for winning. You can be counted on to get better. I'd like to register you on my Pokénav. Hey, it's this guy again. Wait, this is the guy that they said is super strong. Uh-oh. Yeah, he was the guy in the cave. Hmm, hi, Peason. It's been a while. There's something here that you can't see, right? Now, if I ever use this device on the invisible obstacle... No, no. Rather than describing it, I should just show you. That would be more fun. Are your Pokemon ready for battle? <laughs> um... <laughs> um... No! No? I'll wait here so you can get ready. Okay, thank you, thank you, sir. Very kind, sir. <laughs> Reset time? No. <laughs> oh, imagine. Okay, surely he should not have more than like uh, three Pokemon. But either way, I'm gonna go back to the city and heal and maybe swap some of these suckers out. It's this guy. Don't worry, I'll catch him this time. Also, I'm asking the Pokemon fans in chat, in this game, at any point, am I able to buy Everth Stones? Or is it just like, randomly I find them? He smelled me. Yeah, because usually when I play Pokemon, I like to have one of every type. So, like, let's say, for example, I have a Pichu and a Pikachu. I like to give my Pichu an Everstone. That way it never evolves. Pokeball time. Ah, uh, let's do a Great Ball.
easy mine no one's cut mariana bite pokemon in the wild mariana live in a pack they never defy their leader's orders they defeat foes with perfectly coordinated teamwork Yeah, I think I got the Everstone in the cave. I know I have one. But since I have a Puchiana, I either have to, like, press B to make him stop evolving or just give him an Everstone. So I think I'll... If I ever bring back Puchiana, bring back Sad to the run, I'll just press B. My Tiana. My Tiana. Mikey? <laughs> Everybody, welcome Mikey to the team. The first catch of the day. Ooh. Hello, Peason. It's me, Dusty. Are you still battling hard? As for me, <laughs> I lost recently, so I've been training my team all over. Let's meet again. Dude, it's so hard not to make joke. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna heal up and then figure out which Pokemon I want to bring to defeat Steven. Since... Wait, I'll, I'll wait till I have my box open, and then I'll vocalize my thoughts. Since we initially found Steven in the caves, I assume he's gonna have ground Pokemon. So, either way, I'm still gonna try and bring my highest levels. But we're going to put Snazzy in the box. For now. Level 28 Goldeen. Level 29 Glombre. 30 Graveler. Oh, wait, I want to see what moves Pelipper has. Water Flying. Wing Attack. Supersonic. Mist Protect. Ooh. Now, I can't remember if flying is strong against ground. No puedo recordar. Also, don't tell me. <laughs> if you want to find more Everstones, sometimes Geodude or Gravelers can hold them. What? That's crazy! 5% <laughs> guys, I guess we're going to the cave again. Okay, I don't think I'll bring Pelipper. Oh wait, Magikarp has Surf, so I don't I don't need to bring a Water type. I'll bring a. Yeah, I don't necessarily, like, need the Everstone, it's just, like, I'm so used to being able to buy it in, like, the newer games, so, like, I legit would go and buy, like, 20 Everstones and just give them to all my Pokemon. 
But for this playthrough, like, I'm not focusing on doing, like, 100% Pokedex, so it's not, like, a huge priority. Like, honestly, I just need to beat this stupid game. We're at 73 hours. <laughs> okay, so the Steven fight. Blaziken, number one. He's level 42. He will kill. Routes. Gyarados, because he has dark, dragon, and water moves. Lombre, because he's, like, chill. Graveler, because he's high level and Torkoal, so he can get XP. Now, surely Steven won't kill me. Steven is really polite that he would ask to fight first. But then that also gets me scared. Do I have any leaf stones? I have a moonstone and a elect the electric stone. Puchiano. Fighting is strong against dark. Really? No, fighting is strong against normal, because that's from the gym. Puchiana is normal slash dark, I think. Whenever I get to, like, the final Elite Four, I will write down all the types. It's just, it's easier for me if I vocalize it as I play. I know it gets annoying, but you know what? This is how I memorize things. Oh, it's Steven. <laughs> Peace in, are your Pokemon ready for battle? Yeah. Peace in. Show me your true power as a trainer. Steven used the Devon Scope. An invisible Pokemon became completely visible. The startled Pokemon attacked. Oh, it's a Kecleon. I killed it last time. Level 30 Kecleon. Um, I want to catch it. Level 30 Kecleon. Kecleon is... Okay, I thought it would be a, a fight, not like an encounter. Uh... Kecleon... I think Kecleon did a faint attack in one of the encounters I had with it. So that means it's dark type. I'm bringing in Magikarp. And I'm gonna try Bite. Kecleon, my guess, is normal slash dark. Maybe dragon, because he looks like a dragon. Yeah, that's a normal type move. Oh, it, it, it copies the type. That was it. That's why I did faint last time. Okay, okay, okay. So if it's dark type now, then it's weak against psychic, but I don't want to kill it. So let's do dragon range. Please don't kill Magikarp. I'm confused. You know what I'm gonna do? Why not? I don't care. I want a Gagleon. Because I saw it in the animated show, I want it. I don't care, I got a Gagleon. Minus one Ultra Bowl. Gagleon, color swap Pokemon. A Pokemon that has the ability to alter its body colors to match its surroundings. A Gagleon reverts to its original colors if it's startled. Give a nickname? Ooh, what can I call him? He's so cute. I also want the Pokemon that has the paintbrush as a tail. I think that animated show is my favorite from the movies. Hmm. At least this wasn't like a full-on, like, trainer battle. I always get scared. Kecleon, Kecleon. Kecleon, Kecleon. Kecleon. 
Keck is such a... Wait, Keck W. <laughs> I was gonna say, Keck is such a weird sound. Guys, everybody welcome Keck W to the team. I better see some Keck W's in chat. <laughs> I see. Your battle style is intriguing. Your Pokemon have obviously grown since I first met you in Duford. I'd like you to have this Devon scope. Who knows? There may be other concealed Pokemon. You obtained the Devon scope. Peason, I enjoy seeing Pokemon and trainers who strive together. I think you're doing great. Well, let's meet again somewhere. Maybe my garage. I guess he can fly. Okay, I gotta update my Pokemon list, because we caught a Mighty Anna. And then a Kecleon. Plus two. Not the rain. <laughs> he was taken away by an eagle. Hide your five foot and shorter friends. Wait, that's me. Uh oh. Is this now Route 120? Let's fight this guy. After I rearrange the party. Do you have any moves that can strike a flying Pokemon? Oh yeah, I need to see what's weak against or what's strong against flying. I can never remember. Bird Keeper Calling would like to bat. I know Psychic isn't strong. I know probably maybe Raw. I know Ground is weak. Oh, wait, maybe fighting? Not to. Not to is psychic. Psychic flying, I think. I'll keep in Ralph. Oh, yeah, Ralph is already in battle. <laughs> so cute! That still did a significant amount of damage. <laughs> Take the L! You defeated Bird Keeper Colin. You soared above me. You got 1,792 Pokemon Dollars for winning. Oh, those are lots of battles. progress in this area, I want to swap out my Pokemon. I need to be leveling up my other ones. Oh, I should also go back to the gym to see what the clue says. Cobra to level 32! Okay, I'm gonna go back to the city.
You want to use the Devon Scope? Yes, sir. An invisible Pokemon became completely visible. Oh, are they all going to be Kecleons? Wait, if Ralph can copy the color change, can I become different types too? Well, I guess I'm only attacking with psychic type moves, so it doesn't really matter. Huh. Easy. You found one nest ball. Thank you. Let's defeat this Kecleon. Oh, it fled! <laughs> okay, fine. Poetry City Pokemon Gym Leader, Winona. The bird user taking flight into the world. I was wrong. It's not fire, or it's not grass. That would have been too simple. Okay, now I gotta figure out what is strong against flying. Maybe fighting? No, I, I, fighting is either strong against- it's strong or weak against flying. I remember there was like one sequence where it said it was super effective or not effective. Yeah, time to learn. <laughs> God damn it. Okay, well, shit. So that means all of day 11 spent leveling up coal? Kind of pointless. gym where I practice battling Pokemon or I just withdraw flying Pokemon so I can see which attacks work well guys that sucks you know what else sucks watching ads because we are an hour into stream so it's time for me to run some ads you can avoid that ad by subscribing for 4 dollars just five dollars and skip your coffee and get ad free viewing all month long or you can link your Amazon Prime to Twitch and hashtag sub for fuel prime Click subscribe, see if you have a subscription available, and if you subscribe, you can kill my Pokemon. Which is Kecleon. Don't kill Kecleon. I like him. He's cute. Get some water, get a snack. I'll see some of you guys in a few. Oh, shit. Now I gotta... I gotta, like, use my brain now. The type should just be fire, grass, water. It's so simple. Okay. Just sub to take out place again? <laughs> no. We made a rule. You guys can't kill my starter. Only a million gifted subs. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Okay. He's flying. I think... No. 
is... No, ground cannot be strong against slime. Maybe rock? Well, Dean has a flying type move to the up peck. Okay. So what I'm gonna go do is go through all my Pokemon, see who's flying. Normal flying. I thought he was dark. I got a Talo. I'm gonna write these down too. So I have Talo, Skarmory. Zubat. Ninjask. Swablu. Kecleon has a dark and psychic move. Wait, I kind of like Kecleon. I think I want to start battling with Kecleon too. Oh, Pelipper's flying. Okay, so all the flying Pokemon I have is Talos, Skarmory, Zubat, Ninjask, Swablu, and Pelipper. So, I think for now... I, I legit can't remember. Because it's... It either has to be weak against fighting ground or rock it has to be one of those three because i remember being in fights with blaziken and that like either not very effective or super effective popping up in fights with a flying pokemon so i'm gonna take out my two highest level flying pokemon which is gonna be skarmory and pelipper and we're gonna battle with them to see which moves are effective and not effective against them hi electra can we get some yos hello I guess, I guess I can keep leveling up Torkoal, why not? Why not? He's pretty strong anyway. So I'm going to give Skarmory and Pelipper berries. I keep misclicking. Want to try to find wild flying Pokemon? I'm going to do that too. So this is going to be like... Because in the area right here, the only flying Pokemon I saw was a Swablu. I'm not going to do any trainer battles. I'm just going to focus on random encounters for now. Skarmory's the party leader. Does he have... I think he has Peck. Yeah, he's got Peck. And then Pelipper has... 
Misclicked. Yeah, Pelipper has wing attack. And he's a nice move. Okay, plan is simple. I'm gonna do random encounters with Skarmory's party leader. Use Peck to see how it affects different types of Pokemon and then narrow it down. And if I run into a Swablu, I'll swap to probably Magikarp. Or maybe Blaze again, because it's either ground... It's gotta be ground, rock, or fighting. I think it's rock is strong. Because if... Logistically, theoretically, I would think that ground is weak against flying because they can just, like, fly away from the ground. Fighting seems like close combat, so maybe they could fly away too, so I can see, like, flying being weak. But maybe rock, because you can throw rocks in the air. And I don't have many rock Pokemon. The mission, find out what is strong against flying. Bug is weak against flying, I believe. What is the opposite of bug, though? Okay, flying was super effective against Oddish. Oddish is poison and plant. I mean, green. Grass. <laughs> so does that- wait, what? <laughs> I'm confused. So does- <laughs> I'm paralyzed. All the Pokemon fans are probably, like, pulling their hair out. Well, grass is called plant in Spanish. Is it really? I didn't learn that yet on Duolingo. Okay, so that means no poison, no grass to the gym. I, oh, I, need, I should write this down. So poison or grass is weak against flying for now. I, I think it... I'm leaning more towards grass... Because I've used... Wait, no. Because I've used Ralph. That's psychic against poison. That, I already know that. Okay, I'm gonna... I'll figure this out. Give me like an hour. <laughs> is Blanta? Mightyena is not flying. Mightyena is dark normal. Wait, I'm still paralyzed. Shit. Peck. Okay. I'm gonna put yes and then no. So dark, normal question mark. I'm running. So Peck was not effective against normal and dark. I think it's not effective, effective against dark. That to me makes sense. So, oh, wait, wait, wait. So that means if I run into a flying Pokemon, I can test. I can just Magikarp's bite. <gasps> what? This was in the movie! Okay. Um. Absol! I think he's dark. He's evil! Um. Magikarp, you're in. Absol has got to be normal dark. It's gotta be. Okay, Magikarp, don't kill. Oh, yeah, he's dark, he's dark. Okay, he's a dark type.
Yo, I'm here. What? I don't get what taunting does. Is he like grittying in front of me? Okay, I thought Taunt was gonna like increase his attack, but my his attack is already low because Magic Carp intimidates. Okay, don't crit. If you crit, I'm gonna kill you, Magic Carp. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Watch this. Ultra Ball, why not? He's rare. He was in a movie. Easy. Absol was caught. Absol. Disaster Pokemon. It sharply senses even subtle changes in the sky and the land to predict natural disasters. It is a long-lived Pokemon that has a lifespan of 100 years. Absol. I was gonna say Sully. <laughs> what if we just call him Nightmare? Because he's the disaster Pokemon. Absol. I'm kind of thinking Able. But I... Abel sounds like I've named it another Pokemon Abel. Absol. Abby. <laughs> Wait, it's a boy Pokemon. I think Abby's kind of funny. <laughs> Abby. Absol. Soul. Abel is. Wait, what did I. Wait, what? What did I do? What did I do? You can't be using my cards against me. Absol. Absol. I should call it Ableist? No! <laughs> no! <laughs> how, how did you go from Absol to Ableist? That's like calling a Pokemon racist. You can't do that. <laughs> I do me, Electra, stop cooking. I kind of like Abby. I'll do Abby. <laughs> Everybody, welcome Abby to the team. Let's go. Okay, well, I was not expecting to Abso. That's pretty sick. Okay, well, back to figuring out what Pokemon I need. I'm gonna write down Abby on my list. Dude, calling a Pokemon Abel is, That's crazy. Do that on your playthrough, man. Not on the peace and stream. Oh, it's because you said Abel? Oh, okay. That's actually funny. <laughs> but still, go back to the writer's room, man. Okay. I already seen a Mariana. Oh, I should look up what Pokemon's on this route, too. I'll do that real quick. Route 120. Puchiana, Mida, or sorry. Puchiana, Mydiana, Meryl, Oddish, C Dot, Kecleon, and Absol. This walkthrough says Absol is not that good a Pokemon. Okay, so that means I just need to test out. 
A Meryl? Water. Water is probably neither strong nor weak against flying. Sea Dot is grass dark. Okay, I saw a Swablu later on. Route 121, it says there's a Wingle. Let's see where that is. Okay, well, I guess I'll just- I saw a Swablu earlier. Oops. Thank you, Mac. Just send it whenever you're done cooking. I appreciate it. I can move! Okay, so flying is effective against either poison or grass. Poison or grass? Wait, so I need to find what's stronger. Um, ping me on Discord, Mac. Poison or grass Pokemon. So then would Psychic be strong against flying? Okay, I gotta find a Wingle. What is going on? What the hell? Wait, how does Absol have flying moves? What the hell? I'm going back to the Poké Center. I want to look at Absol's character sheet. Something fishy's going on. Absol is a dark type. Oh, Razor One is a normal move? Okay. Oh, that's why. Okay, Razor One is a two turn move. That's why it said for the first turn he was making a whirlwind and then the second turn it hits. Okay. I too. Hmm. Okay, so either poison or grass is weak against flying. So that means the opposite is strong, surely, with the transitive property. That means either fire or psychic is strong.
New plan is simple. I see a flying Pokemon, I just chuck Blaziken at it. Okay, Peck is not strong against water or normal, which makes sense. Swift is normal. Okay, I'm just going to run. I don't want to waste time. Oh my god. <laughs> Mac made me a Google Doc. You take it so seriously. <laughs> Dude, you're so funny. But thank you, Mac. I appreciate all the effort. <laughs> Dude, you're just like me for real. I've been making Google Docs all the time. A monkey and a holy moly. Right now I'm focusing on figuring out what is strong against flying. And then I will go back and level up. If I see a Pokemon that I've seen, I will just run away. Until I get a Wingle. Oh. Tango Miedo. I think here was where I saw a Swablu. Or I had a battle that had a Swablu. Ooh, you know where there was lots of Swablus though? By the volcano. Hmm. Okay, so I either need to find another poison, another grass, and flying Pokemon. So... Poison, grass, fly. There was a good handful of Swablus in Route 114. Poison Pokemon, there was coughing in the volcano caves near Lava Ridge. There was also a Gulpin on a route 110. Should I really backtrack? I, I shouldn't backtrack anyway, because I need to get my berries. And maybe since I got flying Pokemon, they can actually learn fly and we can fast travel. Yo, Pelipper can fly. Honestly, supersonic, stupid. Only 55% accuracy, L. Can I fly now? Wait, how do I fly? So, wait, somebody seriously tell me how to fly. Wait, I have to beat the gym first, don't I? Fuck. No. Ah. God damn it. You just go to the Pokemon and click fly? Really? That can't be real. I do have to beat the gym! Thank you, Wheelie. We tried. At least we tried.
I'm asleep. Okay, the plan is simple. I'm going to go heal, and then I'm gonna go find poison, grass, or flying Pokemon. I misclicked. So there's Swablu here. There's poison Pokemon in the lava tunnel. And there's also Gulpin Route 110. So either way, we're going on a field trip. Get cozy. Make sure you bring your permission slips. Either way, I should go back and like harvest the berries anyway. So it's fine. I just wish like all the type matchups and advantages were as clear as like water and fire. Like that makes so much sense. But no! I'm also gonna rearrange my party a little bit. Because there should not be any encounters when I go back. Can't you talk to the guy in the gym? Wait, I didn't do that. <laughs> Wait, shit. Wait, you're right. Dude, I'm like... I don't play Pokemon for a day and I just forget everything. Well, sometimes the guy in the building doesn't give you hints. He's kind of a dick. Okay, let's see. Imagine he tells me. <laughs> Wait, no, he usually tells you what's, like, weak. I need, I need to know what's strong. Yo, how's it going, champion bound peasant? For tree gym leader Weona is a master of flying type Pokemon. She's waiting at the back of this gym, behind the rotating doors. She's waiting for new challengers who are trying to take wing. Okay, go for it. Okay, he didn't tell me shit! Field trip time, get your permission slips. Turn them in here. God. Minus 30 seconds for my 100 hour run. <laughs> okay, let's make my party. <laughs> uh, type one if you're having fun. <laughs> okay, so I need. I guess because you've been dealing with so many flying Pokemon, the game thought you might have figured it out by now. Well, I, I know which types, like, are in the realm. I'm just not sure. I'm thinking. I think it's just go for it. No, that's scary. No. That's what you guys said about Gym 2, and we lost the game. But yeah, I have a high enough level Pokemon that I could just like sweep, but I'm scared. Um, uh, Pelipper is water flying. So if grass. No say. I think it's clear that fire is strong because I know that bird is strong against bug, and then bug is also really weak to fire. So my guess is fire is strong against wine. Swapping Gyarados out for... I kind of want to level up Tentacool. I think that could be kind of cool. Okay. We continue on. I think Tentacool has Water Gun, too. Oh, I need to get... a Pokemon that picks up items. Mail of date. I 
I don't have any battles, so it's fine if I don't have the amulet coin. Okay, we continue on. I'm gonna try and get a tentacruel. Oh, wait. I have to go all the way back? Okay. She. Snake Zagoon is normal. I'm running. I'm scared. <laughs> There's lightning! The auditors are so annoying. Some of the berries are grown. And they're the citrus berries, which heal 30 HP. And Linoon is normal. It also has poison sting. Flying is not strong against normal, makes sense. You know what else makes sense? Following the channel, because guys, we are 30 minutes in the stream, or another 30. So if you're new here, click that follow button. You get cool emotes and... You get to type in chat. Isn't that pretty cool?
These gosh darn line new ones are so persistent. And Sadio. There we go. Hell yeah. We continue on. Route 118 had... I keep on saying snazzies. It had... I just realized I don't have any Pokemon that no surf! Electric is electric. Wait, I'm weak against electric! I'm water! Okay, elect. It was not. Something is strong against flying. Okay, I need to look up what type electric is. At the next Poké Center. Electric, electric. Electric. I'm running. Wait, that's huge. Oh, wait. Yeah, it was not effective. Yeah, because the wing attack was not effective against electric. Okay. And none of my Pokemon knows Surf. Snazzy learn? No surf? What? <laughs> Wait, what? That's crazy. I forgot. But Tentacool can learn surf too. Ooh, there's berries. I forgot to grab the berries from earlier. She. I got too excited. Winkle is water flying. Yeah, the Pokedex. I like looking at the Pokemon centers. If wait, God, fuck! I got distracted. <laughs> I'm paralyzed. Okay, so poison in grass is hypothetically weak. Blaziken. Oh wait, but it, the water is gonna be strong against fire, so I'm gonna try fighting. Fighting is weak against flying. Okay, weak. Fighting, that's what I figured, which makes sense. So that means my other guess is psychic. But it can't be psychic because I've seen like so many psychic moves not be like effective against the flying. Hmm. Quite the puzzle. My strongest guess is raw.
Okay. I need electric. Oh wait, these Pokemon are different numbers. Oh, Kadabra. Electric. Wait, it doesn't tell me the time. Wait. Am I stupid? <laughs> it's not telling me the time. Okay, maybe I'm D.U.M. Either way, I'm going to the stupid focus center. Maybe that was just fire red and leaf green? Wait, do I have a Manectric? I don't have a Manectric! Um... Let's do Skarmory. Because steel is either weak or strong. Wait, no, he gets electrified! I forgot! I, I remember there was one time where he got blasted. Okay. <laughs> um, Tarko, you're in. Because <laughs> I was like, okay, steel conducts electricity. What the hell? Fire spin. Okay, my only hope is putting him in fire spin. He's smelling me. Ew. He's raising his attack. Uh oh. Great ball. I gotta heal first. Okay, one more spire fire spin won't hurt him. I need to heal first. Uh oh. <laughs> He's free from the fire spin. Great ball. Watch this. Manetric was caught. Manetric, discharge Pokemon. Because lightning falls in its vicinities, Manetric was thought to have been born from lightning. In battle, they create thunderclouds. Oh, is that why he's here? Because there's lightning outside? 
I knew what I was gonna call him the moment I saw him. Everybody, welcome Manny to the team. Easy. Oh, I planted stuff already. Oh, I didn't have to walk around. I could have just used cut. Kalulis. My pen's dying. Manet trick. Man, I've caught four Pokemon already today. Oh yeah, the city's right here. Okay, I, I don't need to heal. If I get an encounter, I will just run away like the coward I am. I appreciate the lurk, Vic. Back here again. I gotta look at the Pokemon types. Electric is electric. So that means flying is not effective against electric, but water is effective against electric, but water does not work against flying. So it's either poison, rock, or fire. I don't think it's gonna be fire. I think, I think it's rock. It's gotta be rock. I should probably get a rock Pokemon. So my theory is still psychic. It's psychic, rock, psychic, rock, fire. Wait, I need to have a psychic Pokemon on my team. Two birds, one stone? Yeah, it's gotta be rock, right? Also, I really appreciate how nobody is spoiling. I genuinely do. But... If I were a kid, or if I was playing this, like, on my own, this is what I would be doing. So I genuinely do appreciate it. Ooh, maybe I can bring in Kecleon! Because Kecleon has a psychic move. They also have a dark move. Yeah, they have Psybeam. Yeah, if... I guess we're gonna test out... Okay, I need to bring this. Okay, Psychic. Rock. And then fire against flying. And then we also need to s confirm if poison or grass is weak against flying. Okay. Oh, wait, I need to see what t type Swablu is. Because I'm going there first. Swablu is normal flying. Okay. And then I also want to check coughing. Coughing is just poison. Okay, so that means if Peck kills coughing, then poison is weak. Wait, why am I testing that? I need to see what's strong. Because I haven't seen anything be super effective against the flying Pokemon yet. 
It's mainly because like I haven't used flying Pokemon in my builds or in my parties. Okay, I gotta figure out where I need to go. <laughs> I'm <laughs> okay. I'm going all the way to 114 to get a stupid swab, Lou. But I guess we can check out the coughings first. So I can take on my bike again. here already <laughs> right now I'm looking for a coffee slugma is fire Touch him! Okay, so fire is not weak against flying, I figured. That was my uh, least powerful guess. Dude, I didn't even touch him! Give me a coughing! Okay, so curse, stupid move. It just does random shit. Like your status buffs. Good thing I got rid of curse. I don't like it. I kind of want to teach Pepper Surf. That way he has a, another offensive move. I'll do that really quick. Cause I don't need fly right now. I can always reteach it. can't forget HM moves. That is so stupid. I hate this stupid game. Okay, now I know you can't unlearn an HM. That's so dumb! I'm learning so many things today. Should we add educational to the tags? Okay, coughing! Now we need to see if this is weak against the flying. Because then that'll either confirm grass or poison is weak against flying. Okay, so poison, then it's gotta be grass. But also coughing can fly, so I think that's an outlier. I'm 
I'm not gonna plant berries because I don't want to waste them. I'm gonna try to plant berries near towns that are closer to me. Because I'm not gonna go back to the lava area for a while, probably. No encounters, nice. Oops. <laughs> Wait, that was a misclick. I, I pressed the wrong thing on my GBA. <laughs> I accidentally pressed R instead of WASD. <laughs> Now, I will find a Swablu. And you know what else I must do right now? Run an ad. Because guys, we are two hours in the stream. So, if you want to avoid that ad, all I must do is subscribe. For four ninety nine, just $5. Skip your coffee and get ad free viewing all month long. Or, you can link your Amazon Prime to Twitch and hashtag sub for free with Prime. Click subscribe, see if you have a subscription available. Also, if you subscribe, you can kill my Pokemon. So don't subscribe. Get some water, get a snack. I'll see some of you guys in a few. Stream ends when I find a Swablu. Okay, low dead is grass and water, but he has dark type moves. Okay, so flying confirmed strong against grass, which doesn't make sense in my head. I guess grass flows in the wind. Wait, that doesn't do anything. That just no. Swablu. Okay, so now I need to test a psychic, a rock move, and then fire. My guess is rock. My strongest guess, we're gonna bring in Sa, he's gonna do rock throw. A critical hit, not effective. Okay, flying was a peck move, or peck was a flying move, was not effective against us, so it's not effective against ground or rock. There we go! Rock is super effective against flying. That was my best guess, and I was correct. Okay. Very good. So that confirms for this upcoming gym, I need to have rock types. Okay. That little 40 minute detour, I figured it out. Rock is strong against flying. I don't think it's psychic because the psychic moves I was using against Swablu and other encounters didn't have any like huge negative or positive effect. So let's figure out which rock Pokemon I have. I, I know I got Saw. I could probably sweep with Saw. Oh, wait. But Sa is also ground type. Wait. Wait. Uh oh. Yeah, he's rock and ground. Wait, I okay, I need to go back and see if I need to do a magnitude, which is a ground type against Swablu. If that doesn't affect it, then I cannot bring Sa. Okay. You would think that rock and ground are the same freaking thing, but they're not. 
I did not crack the puzzle yet. I need to go find another Swablu and try Magnitude. Which, I, d I do not think Ground will work. I'm convinced. I'm gonna keep running away from encounters until I get a Swalu. I'm farming. Got a Swablu? Now we're gonna test magnitude. If the magnitude doesn't work... Blood sport doesn't do damage. It's just a status move. I'm asleep. Okay. It makes sense that the flying Pokemon can just fly above an earthquake. So I need to try a different ground type move. Okay, well, then that means I should not bring Sod to the gym. They really did cook us because in the distant area it was only ground Pokemon. All I can say is that the type of activeness is not always two way. Yeah. I'm still going with rock, but before I start leveling up rock Pokemon, I'm gonna go find another rock one and get the Swablu again. I think Sea Dot is maybe rock and grass. No, he, he only has got normal moves anyway. Okay, Numble does not have any ground type moves, so I can't test. No rock type moves. Maybe Sora? Double-checking Swablu's type again. Yeah, it's normal flying. I'm trying to find a Pokemon that has a ground type. Move. Misclick.
Yeah, everybody's got sand attack, but no offensive moves. Mudslap does damage, not sand attack. Baltoy has Rock Tomb. Ground and Psychic. Level 19. Maybe I'll bring him Baltoy to test against the Swablu. Okay, right now, I'm gonna go test if ground moves are effective against Swablu. So, Rock is Rock and Psychic. They have Rock Throw. And then Baltoy has Mud Slap, and then Rock Tomb. Man, I thought this was gonna be easy peasy. Okay, Swablu. I'm gonna try Mud Slap because it it increases my evasiveness and it does 20 damage as well. It doesn't affect Swablu. Okay, so ground does not work at all. Ground does not work at all. And Peck worked on Baldwin. So I'm gonna run. Okay. So that means the ground type does not work on flying, but then flying is not super effective against ground or psychic. So you can bring ground types to this gym, but it's just the, their offensive moves won't do shit. So I basically have to bring in Pokemon that are rock, but not ground. Which I think right now will be Soul Rock, Aaron. I, those are the two I can list off the top of my head. I kind of want to bring Kecleon, just to like see how it is. But look at this. Wait, watch this. Yep. I'm so cool. Okay, I have the plan. The plan is simple. Rock Pokemon. But they cannot be rock and ground.
So that means no ball toy, because ball toy is a psychic and ground type. We're gonna bring Aaron back. I don't think flying would be effective against steel. Oh, but Aaron doesn't have any rock type. I'm gonna have to level up Aaron anyway. He doesn't have any rock moves. Ooh, wait, maybe I can teach him Rock Tomb. Like, either way, I gotta look for a rock Pokemon. I don't got many. If any at all. Uh oh. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I can still bring Suck. Because the flying moves didn't affect him. I just don't. I just don't use the ground type moves. Because the, the ground wasn't necessarily weak against flying. It just doesn't affect them. Because the peck didn't. Oh, but it didn't hurt Sock because it was rock. Oh, but it was it was the it was ball toy, but he wasn't fully ground. I, I okay, I think it's I can still bring Sock. I can still bring Sock. Do I? <laughs> I don't have any more rock Pokemon. Uh oh. Okay, so the only rock Pokemon I have is Soul Rock, Aaron, and then Su. So I'm gonna have to go into the gym with those three. Su is level 30 already. I think we need one more recent. Stop! Stop! Let me like stand behind my decisions. <laughs> Stop. Okay, okay. So I need to. Su. Hopefully she'll be fine. She'll be fine. I just have to. Either way, I need to either teach Aaron a rock move or level him up so he potentially maybe learns a rock move. And either way, I'll still have Blaziken, I'll still bring Ralph. So I should be fine. Okay, 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 I'm fine. I'm only putting Blaziken in here because I have to take off the item that Torkoal has. Unfortunately, he's not good. Oh, I should give Eren the XP share. And five gyms, Omega Dance. It's almost 75 hours. Okay, Aaron has XP share. I want to bring Kecleon. Kecleon will be like a third wheel. Soul Rock is gonna stay in the box for now. I just have to remember I have to level up Soul Rock as well. Because I wanna have 
both Lie Noon and Snazzy picking up items. Wait, I don't need Torkoal. Dang, I spent all day leveling up Torkoal and I can't even use him. I'll bring in Ralph just in case. Okay, plan is simple. Now that I know that Rock is strong against flying, I'm gonna level up my Rock hybrid Pokemon. So I'm gonna- oh, I wish I could fly. Dang! We gotta go back to Route 120. Oh wait, I can maybe also see like the- like the Route 115 to 118s to see if I missed any Pokemon. <laughs> oh my god, almost a hundred hours of the Nuzlocke. Shut up! <laughs> but hi, Wolves. Hope we're doing okay. Get some rest. Don't push yourself too much. And if you have homework, just be like, Hey, teach. I'm sick. Cough, cough. But don't cough on the teacher. <laughs> we continue on. Stop calling me, Ethan the Playground Man. I don't care about you, Ethan. Ideal meal. So many Pokemon. Oh, not this way. I kind of want to go back to that big boulder. I think the HM is strength. Yeah, strength. can learn it. Honestly, I don't like Mud Slap. I think it's useless. Man, Aaron's so strong! That little guy pushing the boulder. <laughs> oh, what the hell? S un puzzle. Oops. We continue on. 
Segreto. You found one TM06 toxic. Sick. I should have pushed it up. Dang it! I'm so bad at these puzzles. At least they don't like completely lock you out. I bet if I leave and come back, it'll reset. Yep, it reset. Thank goodness. I just want to get the Pokeball. If I was speedrunning, I'd use my Repent. But I'm not speedrunning. Obviously, look at the timer. We're almost at 75 hours? <laughs> just to clarify, that's for like the whole Nuzlocke run, not just this attempt. Wait, what? No. No! I pushed it one too far forward, I think. God damn it. <laughs> 75 hours, everybody. Wow! I gotta do this stupid big puzzle again you know what I'll try a repel just to try it out Peace and quiet.
The only time I could see yourself using Repel is if you're trying to get back to a Poke Center and all your Pokemon are like on the verge of death. That makes sense. Okay. I go like this. Oh, was it really that simple? You found one Firestone? Yo! Wait, the rock's gone. What the hell? There was three there. I got it. Easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. The, that was... That did not feel like 200 steps. Okay, the repels are a scam. I'm never gonna buy them. And of course, now that I don't have a repel, all the Pokemon are coming up. It's almost like I'm Snow White. out of that stinking cave. I'm running because so is weak. Oh. I guess I can't run away. <laughs> Back to reality. Across the ocean. Now I'm gonna see if there's any Pokemon that I missed in these areas. Now, I know ground is strong against electric. Route 118. I think I've got all the Pokemon here. One eighteen Wingle, Zigzagoon, Linoon, Electric, Manectric, and Kecleon. Okay. Yeah, I've got another ones here. And then 119. Zigzagoon, Linoon, Oddish, Kecleon, Tropius. What's Tropius? I guess we're getting a Tropius. Oh, Route 119? This hell? 
trophies. Wait, I saw one! It's like the dinosaur looking thing and I killed it! I remember now. At least the rain doesn't hurt, Saw. I'm gonna change our... I'm gonna change our pin chat. Well, I guess we're back here. I thought it was poison, but it's normal. Yo, you can stop, little guy! Jeez. What? How did my attack miss? Magnitude was 100% accuracy. I'm gonna double check that. Magnitude is 100% accuracy. I guess the mud show or the mud sport and then the sand the sand one can reduce accuracy of those attacks too. Hmm. Now I know.
Lucky Tropius. Atropius is ground and has a banana. It's it's a fruit type. Rock is effective against grass. I'll try with a Pokeball. It probably won't work, but that's fine. Okay, I didn't expect that. Tropius was caught. Wait, it is a fruit Pokeball! I was joking! <laughs> Tropius, fruit Pokemon. It flies by flapping its broad leaves. The bunch of fruit that grows around its neck is deliciously sweet. In the spring, it scatters pollen from its neck. Tropius. Copious amounts of copium. Let's do copium, I kinda like that. Everybody, welcome! Copium Tropius to the team. Let's go. Okay, so I got all the Pokemon in Route 119 then. <laughs> I guess she likes Wingle. Oh, I, there's the berries. Good thing I came back. If you gave a sand attack, your accuracy goes down about 33%. I didn't think it would affect the moves that had 100% accuracy, though. Like, that to me is wild. Because I've used Dragon Rage, which also has 100 accuracy, against Sand Attack. So, I don't know. It's weird. And, like, the Sand Attack didn't affect the Dragon Rage. Maybe it's because it affects all the moves except for moves that bypass accuracy. It could be because I think in the actual move description of Dragon Rage it said it's a guaranteed hit. Maybe that's it. By the way, it's fine. It's fine, I don't care. I was just surprised. We continue on. I can't remember if there was anything here. Wait, watch this. Oh, that was almost perfect. Dang it. Oh, just... Random stuff, okay. Oh. Clean! Poisoned. 
We continue on. Man, Route 119 is massive. I'm glad I found the Tropius fairly quickly, though. I want to get back to Route 120. Because some of the Pokemon were worth like 2 or 400 XP each. This guy's new. The professor loves rain. That's a fact. But if it keeps raining, people will be in trouble. That's another fact. And thus, the professor is studying if the rain could be put to good use. Hello. We've been saved by your actions. Well, I, what I don't understand is what on earth the aquas were up to. Hi, Meg. I appreciate the lurk. Also, Kim has like an hour left on their timeout. <laughs> I mean, hopefully they get their homework done. I've been researching rain for many years, but it's ridiculous to think that humans can freely change the weather. I have a Pokemon that can match the weather, but not change the weather, I don't think. So I guess this Pokemon game is anti-conspiracy. Like, you know, the government's not controlling the weather. Oh yeah, and then I also have a better fishing rod. I still think fishing is kind of a waste of time, rather. Figure out how to get up here. To the left. Oh, there's a bike. Okay. I missed something. Oh, what the hell? There's some way to go around. You want to know a terrible fact about this route? As long as it's not a spoiler. Is it like haunted? There's still one Pokemon you'll probably never, never get if you try to fish in this route with a super rod. Is, like, the likelihood just that low? Are shiny Magikarps gold still? Oh, a 
it's still raining. Dang. Oh, no more rain. Shiny magic, magic covers are still gold? Dude, I want one. That's my goal. Stream ends when I find a golden magic card. plan is simple. I level up Sa, Aaron, and my Soul Raw. The max level for this gym is 33, so I, I, I cannot level over 33. I promise. Let's get to leveling. Oh yeah, I can't use my bike in this area. Route 120. Well, there's also battle encounters that I haven't done yet, too. That are a bit further down. <gasps> Meryl's gonna kill my sub! Grew to level 22. Let's go. Mighty Anna, level 25. Your bite would do that much damage. Jeez. Holy moly. Time for battles. Yeah, I think I'll still make Saw the party leader. That way Saw gets XP and maybe he'll have a type advantage. If not, I'll just swap in Ralph. You're a party Pokemon. Do you have different types? Yes, I do. I have... Ground, Psychic, and Fire. Cool Trainer Lionel would like to battle. He sent out a Manectric. <laughs> Silly, I have a 
Graveler. <laughs> A level eight. Take this L. You defeated Cool Trader Lanel. I've seen your policy in action. You got 1,440 Poké Dollars for winning. Oh yeah, Ralph has the amulet item, so I'm gonna swap that out, actually. Oh, shoot. My bag's full. Now back to battle. You got me! Me, Pokemon, and my parasol. If any one of them is missing, the picture of beauty will be ruined. <laughs> the dialogue is so silly sometimes. Like, I know it's a kid game, but still. Oh, they sent out a cast form. That means it's gonna be water, because it's raining. Cast were transformed. That was decent. Oh my god. That cutscene was crazy. <laughs> um, I'm gonna heal? Because I'm scared. Well, the cast form is faster than me, too. Dang. You defeated Parasol Lady Angelica. You've completely ruined my beauty! You got 2,400 Poké Dollars for winning. Man, she kind of cooked me a little bit. is gonna get cooked the non-subs because guys we are three hours in the stream so it's time for me to run some ads you can avoid that ad by subscribing for 4 dollars just five dollars skip your coffee and get ad free viewing all month long or you can link yours on prime to your twitch and hashtag sub for free with prime click subscribe to see if you got a subscription available Get some more, get a snack. I'll see some of you guys in a few. Also, I gotta use the restroom, so I will be right back. If you could, put your favorite emote in the chat room. This is my new favorite. Blah, ja, ja, ja. <laughs> I'll be right back.
Bye, Wheel. Thanks for hanging out. Hope you enjoy the rest of your day. Thank you for the tips, too. Even though, let's just say I still figured out most of it on my own. But have a good one, Will. Okay. Restarting my timer. And we're back in. If you don't pay attention, you could get hurt. The only person hurting me is you. Battle girl Callie would like to battle. They sent out Metatite. Metatite is fighting and psychic. Which is interesting because it's opposite types. Easy. Sakura to level 31. Two more levels and he's ready for the gym. Battle Girl Kelly is about to use Makuhita. Will I change? Yes, I'll change to Ralph. Merely because I don't want to risk Sa. Because Sa is at the same level all these trainers are. Battle Girl Cali. Oh, I was the one to get hurt. You got 1,344 Poké Dollars for winning. Easy. Let's see this kid jump out. We ninja conceal ourselves under our camouflage cloaks. I bet you didn't know where I was. Ninja Boy Riley would like to battle. They sent out a nin kid on. Ninkita is brown slash grass. Or no, it's bug. Brown slash bug? Mind reader? Uh oh, he took an aim at me. <laughs> uh. Stop reading my mind! I'm not thinking about you, man. Aaron grew to level 23! Ninja Boy Riley is about to use coughing. Will I change? Yes, because Psychic is effective against poison. Riley. I lost! I should camouflage my shame. You got 672 Poké Dollars for winning. I saw that Snazzy had an item. Imagine this is a electrode. <laughs> my bag is full!
Mainly because I want to sell the revive because I think it sells for like a thousand dollars. There we go. I love being a hoarder. What are these alien fields? I'll stay away from that for now. Pokemon have many special abilities. If you want to become a first class trainer, learn about them. Cool trainer Jennifer would like to battle. They sent out a Sableye. So for Sableye, I know he doesn't necessarily have any weakness, but physical moves do not work. Haha. <laughs> Fake out is... It's normal or dark, I think. Oh, he's protecting. Blaziken, well, you're in. Malika's routes will die. Oh yeah, Dark is not strong against fighting, too. Oh, fighting is physical. burned <laughs> you defeated cool trainer Jennifer you're obviously thinking you got 2880 polka dollars for winning Man, I want to go back and get a Sableye so bad. He's so cool. We're in. Ooh, new fruit! You found two as pear berries. As pear berries. That defrost Pokemon in battle. Ooh, does that mean the next area is gonna be ice? We continue on. The alien fields. Why 
made the sleep powder so annoying. Continue on. Oh, it's Talia. I was just thinking, I'm getting bored of the abandoned ship. But since I'm already here, I want to beat you once. I'll be sticking around a bit more. If you feel compelled, why don't you come see me? I think today will be the day that I finally challenge the man next door to a match. Be seeing you. Oh, it's a Pokemon. <laughs> My Diana. My Diana's bite. Oh, his he has intimidate too. I'm switching to Blaziken. Why not? Super effective. Hell yeah. How's your physical fitness? If you're not fit, you can have a rough time in critical situations. Why is she calling me out? That's not very nice. Pokemon Ranger Jenna would like to battle. They sent out a Lotad, level 28. I don't really have any type advantage because Sa is ground so they're weak against the water. And then Ralph is psychic, which doesn't affect. No, Ralph will still affect because he's not a dark type. He's a dark type. Move! But Ralph should be fine. Ooh. Oh, that does nothing. <laughs> Jenner is about to use Nuzleaf. Nuzleaf is ground and grass. Will I change? Yeah. scared of a little Nuzleaf Blaziken. He's nothing to you. Or she's nothing to you. <laughs> Pokemon Ranger Jenna is about to use Lombre. Will I change? Yes. Back to Rap. beat this game at 120 hours? No. Okay, for this run, it's 50 hours, and I'm a little over halfway, so 50 hours from now would be 120. So my guess is 110. Max. You defeated Pokemon Ranger Jenna. I'm totally fit, but you got 2,688 Poké Dollars for winning. Easy. But you guys keep saying 100 hours, 60 hours, 69 hours, Lamau. But you, you suckers will watch it anyway. 
Oh, my bag is full! I need to throw something away. You know what? I'm gonna litter. I'm tossing the mail away. Cancel me. Stinking rich. Another mighty enemy. You know. Aaron grew to level 24. Getting there. They probably made the grass like this so you could just avoid encounters and trainer battles. Okay, I'll fight with some. I'll try it. Level 9? Oh, I thought- <laughs> Okay, that's fine. I'll check your Pokemon and see if they're fit for the outdoors. And I'll also check you out. <laughs> Pokemon Ranger Lorenzo would like to battle. He sent out Seedot level 28. Seed on his grains. A crit, holy. Pokemon Ranger Lorenzo is about to use Lone Bear. Will I change? Yes. To Ralph. Pokemon Ranger Lorenzo is about to use Nuzly. Will I change? No. Psychic doesn't affect Nuzly. Is he dark? No way. No way. No way.
Rose Leaf will do nothing to me. <laughs> you defeated Pokemon Ranger Lorenzo. With a Pokemon that strong, you're in no danger of needing rescue. We got 2,688 Poké Dollars for winning. This is Abigail. I'm cycling right now. I love swimming and running, but cycling is my first love. It makes my whole body feel as if I'm one with the wind. It exhilarates me as if I were flying. Okay, today, I'm gonna set a new cycling red record. You should make the challenge too. See ya. Another mighty Anna. Oh, my attack rose, what? And I'm confused? He rinsed. I'm running away, that's so annoying. I can't escape? And that costs a turn, too? That's so annoying. Come on, just do the earthquake. Dude! So annoying. Um, breakthrough. Thank you! Blaziken is a superior Pokemon. Quick attack. on one nugget. Make one. There's gold here. Oh, I can't go this way, okay. Out of the rain. Oh, that's so pretty. The shadow in the clouds. This game is great, isn't it? Oh. I'll talk to you later, sir. Actually, never mind. Another Absol?
easy. Want to battle? I guess. Bug Meteor Jeffrey would like to battle. They sent out a surskit. Okay. Wait, is surskit flying? No way. Ain't no way. It does, like, fly across the water. He has another surf kit? He's so stupid. <laughs> Their skin was water. Whoa. Aaron grew to level 25. Let's go. God damn it. Ah, Aaron's trying to learn takedown. Normal. I don't want to take down, it hurts me. You defeated Bug Meteor Jeffrey. Lost it. You got three thousand two hundred forty poker dollars for winning. Oh. Uh, do you have a poker nav? God. I'm taking the item. I don't care. I need the amulet. My bag is full. <laughs> ah. Man. That was such a stupid mistake. The only Pokemon that has a rock type move is Soul Rock. So I have to level up Soul Rock now. God, that. I'm gonna go back. Even the sprites stop moving too. Man. How do I get back?
I can't go back. Fuck! How do I get back? Bunny hop? No, I can't bunny hop. Thank goodness. Okay. Okay, either way, I have to go back so I can get Soul Rock. Dude, I cannot believe I lost so. I'm so disappointed. I'm gonna take Sa's item. My bag is full, never mind. I'm gonna take Saw's amulet. Man, this is so bad. I 
I lost Sada was a stupid mistake. I forgot Sursuke was water. One eight KO'd me. Everybody, peace I two seven graveler. It truly is the worst timeline. But it's fine. I still have Soul Rock. You know what my mistake was? Usually, the main Pokemon that I use for the gym, I don't make the party leader. But I wanted to level him up. It's fine. Aaron's level 15. Soul Rock is 16. Soul Rock is my only Pokemon that has a rock move. But for now, I need to have three stronger Pokemon in my team. So I'm gonna take the XP share from Aaron and I'll give it to Soul Rock. Aaron will learn a rock move. I'm gonna see what TMs and HMs I have. Oh, rock Smash is fighting? What the hell? Dig is ground. Rock tomb. TMs you can only use once. Hi Alex, welcome in. Can we get some yo's? Hello. I have one rock tomb. I'm gonna hold on to it. Here we go. Did you subscribe, Alex? Tell the truth. Thank you for the tier one. No, that's a new sub! Oh no! But thank you for converting your gift sub to a tier one. I appreciate that. Can we get some Walexes in chat? Thank you. I really do appreciate the tier one. Thank you. <sighs> no. Dude, I don't know what I'm gonna do now. I mean, I like, I know what I have to do, but I I'm so, I'm not frustrated. I'm just like, I'm disheartened. It was such a stupid mistake, too. <sighs> okay, I gotta cross off that. I killed Saw. Oh. Maybe? Wait. Graveler's not even the final evolution. Maybe there's an area where I can go back and get a Graveler. Because I think he evolved from Geodude. <sighs> yeah, I, I caught him as a Geodude. Man.
Well, guys, long stream. I thought it was only gonna be five hours, but no. It's, it's, I'm gonna need to do like four hours of leveling. Fuck! Okay. Let's update the release counter. Seven. See, you guys don't even have to like subscribe. I'll just kill my own fucking Pokemon. Okay. Back to work. Man, I just realized I have $95,000. Holy moly, I'm rich. Hmm. Well, back to... Back to the good old grind. How many subs to Merka Pokemon? One more, because it was out of five. But please don't. <laughs> You'll kill my Tropius. Which, apparently, Tropius isn't that strong anyway, so, like, it's fine, but, like, also, I can't take another loss right now. I continue onwards with no su in hand. At least I learned that I can backtrack back to this area, so it's fine if I gotta go back and heal again. Oh, it's so you can surf. Okay, I was confused. <laughs> you found one hyper potion. More berries. So many berries. We pair berries. We pair berry. Pokeblock ingredient. I don't need that shit. child. I will adopt the movements of Pokemon and create new ninja techniques. Ninja Boy Kaigo sent out coughing. Ralph was gonna demolish you. Ninja Boy Kaigo is about to use Ninja. Will I change? No. Because it's bug flying. Psychic can miss? 
What the hell? Fury Cutter was super effective. Roth to level 38, let's go! So, grew to level 17. My favorite number. You defeated Ninja Boy Kaigo. The creation of new ninja techniques is but a distant dream. You got 672 Boko Dollars for winning. Back in the rain. Oh! He caught me! Who might you be? Are you perhaps searching for an ancient ruins that are rumored to possibly exist according to legend? No, I just work here. <laughs> Ruin Maniac Chip would like to battle. They sent out a ball toy at level 27. Ball toy is psychic... Ground. Oh, thank God. Whenever I see a new animation for a move, I'm like, uh oh. Chip is about to use Sandra. Will I change? No. Room meeting Chip is about to use Sand Slash. Will I change? No. Over to level 18, let's go! Only 15 levels to go. You defeated Ruin Maniac Chip. What a disgraceful setback. You got 3,240 Poké Dollars for winning. Just empty land. Oh wait, this is another legendary spawning spot, isn't it? Kick Leon. Nothing else really here. Bye. 
I see Maddie in it, I'm just running. It's not worth my time. Oh, okay, I gotta surf there. You found one full heal. Oh, she's not battling. Berries grow by soaking up sunlight. We help the berries grow by watering them regularly. It's an expression of love, isn't it? Yeah, why not? Yes, you understand what I mean. You should take this. You obtain the wiki berry. I think that berry is rare. Hope you raise it with loving care. I bet it's a berry that revives. Wikiberry. A hold on that restores HP but may confuse. Okay, that's... <laughs> that's horrible! <laughs> that's horrible! The berry itself looks cursed too. It looks goopy. Look at it. I don't want that shit. Continue on. Route right in twenty one to the right. There are powers beyond our understanding in the world. Okay. Oh, they're probably gonna have Psychic. Hex Maniac Tammy would like to battle. Ghost Pokemon? I remember from the anime. Ghost is strong against Psychic. Because Ash had to go catch a Haunter to defeat her Kadabra. Blaziken's in. Okay, fighting or physical attacks don't affect the ghost, which makes sense. Blaze kick works. Neither effective nor weak. So, grew to level 19. So, it's trying to learn Fire Spin. Ooh, okay. Fire Spin traps the foes in a ring of fire for two to five turns. Yeah, I don't need tackle. One, two, and so forgot tackle and learn Fire Spin. Hex Maniac Tammy is about to use Shuppet. Will I change? No. Blaziken grew to level 43. You defeated Hex Maniac Tammy. I've lost. We got 1,392 Pokedollars for winning. 
I wonder if Ghost would be strong against flying? Hmm. Ooh, more berries! Looks like some unavoidable encounters up ahead. Persim berries. I think those are new. Oh, it just heals confusion. I have had that before. The tree just looked new. Oh, he cut me! Can't you see I have all this stuff with me? Despite that, you still insist that we battle? No, you're the one who asked me, man. Like, I'm just walking. Bug Media Kale would like to battle. He sent out dust dogs. I think dust dogs is poison bug. Yep, he's poison. I can't remember if he's dark or poison. I don't know why I get it mixed up. So, we're to level 20. Let's go! Bug Meteor kills, but he's beautiful. Will I change? No. I'm not messing around no more. You defeated Bug Meteor Kale. Of course I lost. I'm holding stuff in both hands. You got 3,480 Polka Dollars for winning. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. You know what else is easy? Subscribing. Because guys, we're four hours in the stream and I'm upset. I lost Sa. Uh, the one time I need him. Wait, the, he would have been... I used him in the electric gym too. He would have been a two-time gym leader winner. A defeater. Dang. Anyway, click subscribe. See if you got a prime sub. It's free. Or a tier one. But also don't subscribe because you can kill my Pokemon. Please don't. I, I do not need the pain today. I cannot believe I murps. Uh, I cannot believe I did. Also, Kim has only got three minutes left on their timeout. <laughs> Back to it. I assume there's gonna be something scary up ahead if there's ghost encounters. And potentially new Pokemon, too. An Oddish. Classic. Ralph will kill it. So we're gonna bring in Magikarp. 
bloom. Don't poison me. That's so mean. I'm gonna do Twister. Because this should not one hit you. Okay, we're good. Thank God you missed. I would have been so mad. How dare you poison me? Pokeball first. Gloom was caught. Gloom, weed Pokemon. A horribly nauseous honey drools from its mouth. One whiff of the honey can result in memory loss. Some fans are said to enjoy this overwhelming stink, however. Gloom. Gloom. I'm kind of thinking Glen, but I, I want to keep the ooh sound. What if I just do... Ooh! <laughs> Everybody welcome Ooh to the team! <laughs> okay, I need to heal. Oh, it's in my item box? There we go, easy. Back up to Clar. Aqua! Ain't no way. I must stop them. Stop! Have a good look at my precious Pokemon! Beauty Jessica would like to battle. They sent out Kecleon. His special defense spell, how? Wait. It said Lick was super effective against me. So that means I'm weak to ghost type. Uh oh. So, grew to level 21. Beauty Jessica is about to use Surviper. Will I change? No, because Surviper is poison.
Easy. You defeated Beauty Jessica. Oh, how dare you! Don't take it so seriously. You got four thousand six hundred and forty poker dollars for winning. I took it easy on this time. It won't be that way the next time. We continue on. Okay, we're to move out to Mont Pyre. Okay, that was underwhelming. Filled with rare Pokemon, the Safari Zone. Welcome to the Safari Zone! Here you may witness many kinds of Pokémon rarely seen in Hoenn, and you'll see them in their wild, untamed state and natural habitats. What's more, we've thrown we've thrown open the gates to Pokémon trainers. They're encouraged to catch Pokémon for keeps. Come in and enjoy the Safari Zone. Okay. Welcome to the Safari Zone. Is this your first time here? Yes, sir. When you enter the Safari Zone, you'll start with 30 Safari Z Balls for catching Pokémon. The safari game is over when you run out of safari balls, or when you walk 500 steps. Come and enjoy the safari zone. Welcome to the safari zone. All you can catch for just $500. Would you like to play? Yes. I need poke blocks. What? Wait, what? 500 poke dollars. Yes. You seem to be without a Pokeblock case. Your safari game will be much more fruitful if you use Pokeblocks. Please come back with a Pokeblock case. You can obtain a case from the Lily Cove Contest Hall. Come on! You can't dangle it in front of my face and tell me I can't go in. I want a new Pokemon. They're so mean. They're elitist is what they are. Man, just L after L today. You found one zinc. A head looms Mount Pyre. It is a natural monument to the spirits of departed Pokemon. Mount Pyre Pier. The sign is old and worn out. The words are barely legible. I don't think I want to go there yet. I'll be honest. Another Orish. Let's fight these two. Wait, I gotta make sure my party's ready? Yeah, I got Blaziken and Ralph. Together we're fearless. We'll demonstrate how tough we are. Senior and Junior Kate and Joy would like to battle. They sent out a Spinda and Slacking. Slacking killed Kadabra. Okay, Ralph needs to be swapped out. Because Spinda has faint, which is a dark move.
Okay, both their attacks are lowered. Oh yeah, Blaziken is super strong. <laughs> I forget. <laughs> So, crew to level 22. And Serio. I almost did Surf, but I forgot Blaziken's on the board. <laughs> Imagine. Okay, Slacking is a dark type. Because it never makes a ch ch Sound it means it's super effective. Easy. You defeated senior and junior Kate and Joy. Please forgive me, Kate. You got two thousand and forty eight Pokedollars for winning. Oop. Double battle. There's so many trainers here. And there's no Poke Center. Oh, I'm I'm right by the city though. I'm literally right here. I want everybody to see the Pokemon I've raised. Pokemon Breeder Pat would like to battle. They have six Pokemon? Level 25 Poochiana? Dude, imagine getting caught up in a double battle with this. Oh my god, that would have been crazy. Pokemon Rita Pat is about to use Meryl. Will I swap? Yes. I'll put a Magikarp. I'll be fine, because the only move that Meryl can use is Rollout. Because I, I want to save Ralph's PP. Because there's a lot of trainers up ahead. Okay, the roll only did 10, I'll be fine. Pokemon Breeder Pad is about to use Electric. Will I change? Yes. Man, if I had sub. Electric. I don't necessarily have any Pokemon that have an advantage. I'll go Ralph. No, I, I, sh I should have done Blaziken to save Ralph's hit points. Yup. So, grew to level 23. Pokemon Breeder Pad is about to use Shroomish. Will I change? Yes, because Shroomish is grass. So Blaziken has the type advantage. Pokemon Breeder Pad is about to use Sand Shrew. Will I change? Yes, because water is strong against ground. Honestly, the 
Blaziken, Gyarados, and whatever Ralph is, that combo is pretty good. <laughs> Let's drown this Sandshrew. Magikarp grew to level 37. Pokemon Reaper Pot is about to use Gulpin. Will I change? Yes, Gulpin is poison, so Ralph will be effective. I basically had a type advantage for every single one of her Pokemon. You defeated Pokemon Breeder Pat. Wow, spectacular! You got 2,000 Poké Dollars for winning. Dang, that was crazy. Also, I got a mute.
sorry, my sister got home, and she's like, I want to play game. And I said, no, I have to beat this stupid Nuzlocke. And she was like, well, when will you be done? And I said, well, I would have been an hour from now, but I lost a sub. There's nothing I love more than checking out other people's Pokemon. So, it's gonna take me at least like three hours to level up. Or maybe, maybe two. But since there's so many encounters here, there's six Pokemon? Pokemon Breeder Miles would like to battle. A Makuhita. Dude, if this would have been a double battle, I would have been cooked! I really do appreciate how you can avoid the double battles, and it's honestly huge. So anyway, it's gonna take me at least like two hours to level up properly to be like kind of ready for the gym because I lost Suh. It's like horrible! Anyway guys, she wants me to end stream by 5 p.m. So I have an hour and a half to level up. She said if I don't finish by 5, she's gonna play Mafia without me. And we're just getting to the part where he has a girlfriend. Pokemon Breeder Miles is about to use Zigzagoon. Will I switch? Yes, because I need to save Ralph's uh, PP. Honestly, uh, I'll do Blaze again. I want to sweep. I, I need to start speedrunning. Like, seriously. I need to play Mafia. Anyway, that whole, like, three minutes was me going back and forth. Being like, no, please. I want to play Pokemon. <laughs> or it's not that I want to play. I have to. I, I want to try and beat the gym today. Like, I have to. Pokemon Breeder Mouse is about to use Nubble. Light change? Yes. Nubble is grounded fire, so doubly weak to water. Man, it's actually so bad that I lost so. Uh... Oh, I cannot believe I made such a stupid mistake. So, grew to level 24. Getting there. Pokemon Breeder Miles is about to use Electric. Will I change? Yes? Man, if I had so... I'm, I'm like getting upset in my head. I'm like beating myself up in my head. No puedo... Oh, how do you... How do you say... I don't believe... Like in Spanish. Like, how did this happen? Como... Or que pasó is like, what happened? Or what's up, casual. I don't know how to say like, what happened? Or how did this happen? Pokemon Breeder Mouse is about to use Wingo. Will I change? Yeah. No, but not gonna lie, Blaziken, Ralph, and Magikarp is a really good rotation. Pokemon Breeder, Miles is about to use Tropius. Tropius is grass and it's a fruit Pokemon? No, I didn't change! I pressed B by accident on my stupid GBA. Oh, Blaziken's paralyzed too. That's not ideal, but he'll he'll push through. He's cool. My evasiveness fell. Uh oh. Watch this. Not that, but watch this. You defeated Pokemon Breeder Miles. Super awesome. You got 2,000 Pokedollars for winning. That was pretty cool. 
You find one revive. I don't need that shit. Do they not know that I'm doing the Peace Lock 2024? Like, come on. Okay, I gotta heal up my Pokemon. Gianna. Oh, no, I, I just want to run away. Dodged, but I still want to fight him. With my Pokemon, I have traveled to the world's four quarters. You might say I have some confidence in my abilities. Gentleman Walter would like to battle. He sent out a Manectric. Man, so would crush. Easy. So, grew to level 25. So, I was trying to learn Psy Wave. Psy Wave attacks with a psychic wave of varying intensity. 80% accuracy. That sounds stupid. I don't like when it's like non-guaranteed. I don't like gambling. I don't like chance. Screw Psywave. I don't want it. So did not learn Psywave. You defeated Gentleman Walter. Ah, oh, well played. You got 4,640 Pokedollars for winning. I'm rich. I'm rich. I'm really, really rich. Your Pokemon prowess is remarkable. Allow me to register you as a Bobento. <laughs> you want to remember me, old man? Add him to the playground men list. Oh, mighty Anna. Ooh, Rob was really close to leveling up, actually. I should probably keep this fight. I'll switch, Blaziken. You're in. Why not? The swagger is so- I hate being confused. It's generally so frustrating. You know, it's just frustrating. Not following the peace and channel, because guys, we are another 30 minutes in the stream, so if you never click the follow button, you get cool emotes and you get the type of chat. Isn't that pretty cool? Do it now. And I'll feel better. <laughs> oh, I hate my Diana. It's probably the same one. Anyway, the, the more I play the Pokemon game for Peace Lock, the I can tell I'm getting more and more frustrated. <laughs> I think it's because I've spent so much time leveling up, like, my core Pokemon. Where losing Su, like, maybe three days ago would have been nothing. But now that we're 12 days in, technically 13, it hurts so much more. I'll be fine. I'm just gonna eat ice cream when I'm not- <gasps> Eat ice cream I'm not supposed to and cry myself to sleep. A shuppet appeared. Psychic is weak against ghosts. Magikarp, you're in. Now, Magikarp, I know you're almost 10 levels above, but do not kill. I would love a shuppet. I don't know, like, how powerful it is, but I love saying shuppet. It sounds like shut it. Wait, <laughs> we'll call it Shut It. Hi, Jay. Welcome in. Can we get some yo's? Hello. Twister. That pack. 
back to punch. Twister, one more time, do not crit. Thank you. Thank you. I'm going to heal first to be extra safe. I'm only going to be playing this game extra safe the rest of the however many hours. See, Nightshade again, that would have cooked me. Pokeball time. Great ball. Shuppet was caught. Shuppet. Puppet Pokemon. This Pokemon roams about deep in the night, seeking such negative emotions as grudges and envy. It retreats to its nest when the sun begins to rise. Shuppet. I want to keep it shop it because it's so fun to say, but I think I think shut it is so funny. It sensed your grudge. I know. It heard me yapping about Sa, and he just appeared. Okay, I'm gonna make the executive decision. I'm gonna put a hyphen, because I don't want to have T-I-T -T on the screen. If you know, you know. Kim said you should go play games with your sister. Aww. You know, Tim, Kim should be out of time out by now. It's been four hours. You know what, I'll be honest, I probably will end at 5pm. Mainly because she... She will play Mafia without me. She's like that petty. But we'll see how much I can level up. I might be able to level up in time if there's more encounters in this area, so... Everybody, welcome Shut It to the team! <laughs> okay. Okay. Will you play with my delightfully pretty Pokemon? Pokefan Vanessa would like to battle. They sent out a Pikachu! Oh, it's the first time seeing Pikachu in this run! Psychic does. I know this won't KO, but it'll at least do half. Oh! Okay, easy peasy. Ralph grew to level 39. You defeated Pokefan Vanessa. This isn't what I meant. You got 4,800 Poke Dollars for winning. Easy peasy, a lemon squeezy. There's something hiding, but I don't have time. Oh, he caught me! My Pokemon never tasted defeat. On our next win, I'm entering them into contests. Cool trainer Marcel would like to battle. He sent out a Manectric. Man, so would do so well.
Take the L. A shift tree. That sounds like a grass type. I have an idea of who this Pokemon is. Is it the final Seedon? Yes! See, I know what he looks like. I think Shiftry looks so cool. I want one. Oh, that, that. You defeated Cool Trina Marcel. Oh, now what happened here? You got 2,784 Poké Dollars for winning. Let's go. Hi, welcome in. Can we get some yo's? Hello. Welcome in, Pink. We continue on. Dodged. No! <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to get the berries. I have this routine. Defeat five trainers a day. Guess what? You're number five. I feel special. Cool trainer Kristen would like to battle. He sent out a Loudred. Loudred is normal. But confusion should hurt them. Should, not should. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. So, grew to level 26. Cool trainer Kristen is about to use Vigoroth. Will I change? Yes, Vigoroth is the center evolution of slacking, so it might have dark moves. So, Blaziken, you're in. Wait, no! Uh, no, I'm thinking of the wrong guy. Vigoroth is the guy with he's white and he has claws. No, oh, it is the middle form of slacking. It's whatever. I, Because I always get Vigoroth and then the one that looks like a furry. I get those mixed up. Vigoroth is a dark type. Oh, wait, no, it's normal. Fighting is strong against normal. Why do I keep thinking it's dark? I think slacking is still normal, but he has dark type moves. You would defeated Cool Trainer Kristen. No, you're horrid. You got 2,784 Poké Dollars for winning. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. That was total humiliation. I won't forget you. Hand over your Poké Nav. Am I getting robbed? We continue on. Finally, the city, Lily Cove City. Lily Cove City, where the land ends and the sea begins. Okay, I, I'll explore the town later. I just want to heal, and then I'm going to go back to Rune 20 and level up as much as I can. Thank you, Norse Joy. Oh, 
Okay, so is at level 26. I need to get so to level 33 minimum. Maybe even 35, because that's going to be my main Pokemon for this gym. Yeah, so for the next hour and a half, we'll just level. Try to get as high as I can, and then I'll play Mafia with my favorite sister. Yeah, that's the plan. I also should be leveling on my other Pokemon, Ralph and Blaziken are too powerful right now. Well, either way, I've done all the encounters on Route 120 and 121. I'm gonna give Megacarp... ...an item. I kinda wanna give him the first strike. And then I might change my party leader Pokémon... ...to a different one whenever we get to the Poké Center back home. Wait, no, I'm at a Poké Center right now, what am I doing? <laughs> Lamau. Okay, so the Pokémon in this area... Are like level 27 to 30. Let's see, Torkoal is 32. Lombard 29. Gloom 28. Let's see what Gloom has. Grass Poison. Poison Powder, Stun Spore, Sleep Powder, Acid. The only offensive move is Acid. Because I want to try and get all- as many Pokemon as I can to level 30. I'll bring back Pelipper, why not? And then I'll have Ralph and Blaziken as backups in case Pelipper, like, just kills over or something. <laughs> Plan is simple, leveling up, going back to Route 120. That way I'm closer to a Poké Center. And I'll explore Lily Cove City next time. Whenever I beat the gym. Mighty and a Dark type, level 28. Ooh, he has Intimidate. Ooh. I'll try Wing Attack to see how much it does. Yeah, I, I should probably just run away. I can't- I missed a turn! Thank you, Mariana, for just ending the fight. You suck. I know we can swim here, but I'll save that for a different day. Because obviously, Peace Lock is going to be a few more days. <laughs> Level 26, Mariana. Anytime I see a Mariana, I'm just leaving. He's not worth it. Just like all the bimbos, they're not worth your time. Back to Route 120. Let's see if there's any new Pokemon. Route 120. Poochiana, Mightyena, Meryl, Oddish, Seedot, Kecleon, and Absol. Route 21, or 120. Poochiana, Mightyena, Oddish, Gloom, Kecleon, Wingle, and Shuppet. Okay, so I've gotten all the Pokemon in 120 121, so I'm totally fine to level up in just Route 120. Very nice. Oop. Dead end.
Home sweet home. Oddish. Oh yeah, Oddish is weak to flying type moves. Easy. Hey there, Pizen. It's me, Nob. I just got cleaned at a battle. I guess I need to raise my team some more. Take the L-Scrub. <laughs> Mighty and at level 27. Yeah, so if the Mighty Anna has the Intimidate, I'm just gonna switch to Blaziken. Just so I still get XP. Okay, thanks for wasting my time. I bet it's the same Mighty Anna. <laughs> He smelled me! Easy. Yeah, there's no other grass patch. Because I want to take on my bike just so I go faster, but I guess not. So... Finally, to the real leveling up of the day after nearly five hours. But you know what? I figured out what is strong and weak against flying, and also I lost a very key part of the team. <laughs> but you know what? It'll be fine. Soul is already at, I think, level 25, so it'll be fine. I think Cell will be kind of similar to losing Azumarill because they both had two offensive moves of their types and then also they both had Defense Curl. And you know what? I've been able to beat the gyms without Meryl, so I'll be fine without Cell. And even for being as high level as Cell was, he didn't have a good amount of HP. Like, he only had 80. When other Pokemon his level had like 90 or 100. So in reality, maybe Cell wasn't good. I'm asleep. This Oddish is a menace. <laughs> Stop! Seriously! At least it didn't poison me, jeez. Holy moly. Who thought one little shrub could take me out? Or not take me out entirely, but make me go to the Pokemon Center. Thank you. 
How is Rollout super effective? Maybe it's because it's rock and not ground attack? Holy! What is rollout? Oh wait, I gotta mute. We got till 5.30, guys. 5.30 at the latest. So that means I'm ending Pokemon in an hour. Let's level up as much as I physically can. Imagine using water gun. <laughs> Level 27. Getting there. annoying. Everything is looking good so far. You know what else is really good? Watching ads. Just kidding. Guys, we are five hours in the stream, so it's time for me to run some ads. You can avoid that out about subscribing. For $4.99, just $5. Click subscribe to see if you got a Prime sub available. I ain't wasting no time. Get some water, get a snack. I'll see some of you guys in a few. Oh, 
we're back in. My goal is to get Soul Rock to at least 30. It'll probably take like 20 30 minutes to do that. Whew. It's been like two hours, and I've almost forgotten that Cell was with us. But anytime I see any Meryl, it reminds me of all the fallen soldiers. That did no damage. <laughs> Pepper grew to level 29. Finally, not a Poochie or a Mighty in Try fly. Oh, I'm in the air. <laughs> I love how the fly animation is just a blue orb. They didn't want to animate all the Pokemon who can do fly. <laughs> you were like, oh, just put a blue circle. The kids will get it. It'll be like the dodgeballs they see at school. I guess if I'm paralyzed, I should try and fly. That way I don't take damage in between turns. Oh, that one was successful.
Not the swagger. Wait, the paralysis outdid the confusion. <laughs> nice. Okay, the flight is actually kind of sick cuz you can't you basically dodge attacks for a turn too. Pelipper also has protect, but I kind of want to swap it out for surf. I'll wait on that, I think, because I don't think you can unlearn the move until you unlock a new move when it naturally levels up. I don't want to give it Surf just yet, because you can't unlearn Fly. And I'm in the air. Oh, the Fly didn't work! <laughs> I'll do one more encounter and then I'll go heal up the Poke Center. Don't scared me a little bit. I forgot Meryl has rollout. <laughs> I forgot I gave him a berry. He's in the air. Come on. Rop is in. My goat. Let's get out of here. How's training going so far? It's going all right. Gradually loving up my other Pokemon that I don't need for this gym, but it'll be a hot minute. Can we get some yos? Welcome in heart. I haven't taken any major L since I lost Saw, so to me that's a huge dub.
Any changes to the roster? Yeah. Dude, it was so dumb. I was facing my... It was my Graveler against a Surskit. And I forgot that Surskit was a water type. And it got basically one hit KO'd, so I lost like my highest level ground type. But you know what? We all make mistakes. <laughs> Which is the type I need for this gym, for gym six. But you know what? That was hours ago. I forgot on it. I'm fine. So I'm going to level 28. Let's go. I think the most frustrating thing is that the last two Pokemon I lost were me being, like, clueless and negligent and forgetting about types. And you know what? I think it's because of fatigue. I'm tired. Not, like, physically tired. I'm just tired of Pokemon. <laughs> 77 hours? Am I gonna do Gym 6? Maybe, if I get like a million levels in the next 50 minutes. I'm gonna- cause my sister wants to play games later. And I gotta be a good sister. Yo! We're gonna continue Mafia. We got to the chapter where, like, he has a GF question mark. Because she bought, like, the bundle for the PlayStation that had the Definitive Edition and then ports of all the previous versions. So, we're playing through it together. And by together, I mean... I just play whenever she can't do the mission, which is very rare. The mission that I had to do for her was the racing one. Uh-oh, my attack is lowered. I forgot. I See, I'm vegging out. Sorry, that's not a- I should- I'm zoning out. I'm trying to avoid saying veg. That's not very nice. Anyway. She was stuck on this one mission. It was the funeral mission, if anybody's played the game. It took- <laughs> It took her like an hour, because <laughs> the whole mission is like shooting, which obviously I can't do. I'm not good at aiming. You guys saw me play Fortnite. So like, I obviously can't help with that mission. <laughs> so she was stuck for an hour. <laughs> I think it's because she and I have a very similar playstyle play style type in most games, is we're very offensive. Like, we'll just go into a battle without planning. Like, you see how I play Pokemon on full offensive builds, usually? And that's kind of how she is, too. So, Because <laughs> the mission is you have to, like, go to a hotel and then go to a funeral. So, for the first half of the mission... Um... Like, she had- you had to kill, like, uh, like, 20, 50 guys in the hotel. But she just kept on running through. <laughs> And not, like, blasting the enemies. And you can only take, like, five, six hits. So she would try to run through the whole building without getting the enemies. So she would just die after, like, five seconds. And she'd try that for, like, ten minutes straight. And she's like, why isn't this working? <laughs> I don't know. She's like, clueless. It's because she and I also hate doing stealth missions. They're so annoying. That's a big reason why. I, I like the idea of the game Hitman. Like, it looks fun, but the stealth missions... They, they would take me out. The Mighty is so annoying. I tell ya.
Oh, he bit me! Dude, Pepper's not even to level 30 yet. Ideal meal. The moment I see a Meryl, I'm flying. Screw the Merrills. Candy Linus is so cool. I am very lucky that both my Zigzagoon and Linoon had the scavenging trait. So lucky. Ahoy, Elliot here. 
As always, I'm fishing with Wild and Bandit. Are there other places I can fish than the sea and rivers? I get these powerful lurges to fish just about anywhere. Oh, gosh darn it. My lang's tangled up. Gotta go. Find me some new fishing spawns. Whenever I get Pepper to level 30, I want to swap him up for a different Pokemon. So, grew to level 29. Four more till he's ready for the gym. Still no more rock moves learned. I was literally going to say, how have I not found another Absol? Absol is normal dark. I'm gonna fly. Not too bad. Um, I'm gonna swap because I'm scared. Oh, I thought it was gonna whip out a sword. Okay. Easy. Let's get out of here. It's 4.21 p.m. I just missed the funny number. Yeah, Soul Rock is 29. Getting there. Seriously? Wasting my time like that.
These mighty Annas truly are testing my patience. Watch this, Pepper's gonna level up. Pepper grew to level 30, let's go! I'll swap him out for another Pokemon. Wait, no. Maybe... I'll get him to level 33, I lied. Because if this gym is level 33, the next gym... I have to be 42? I'll keep leveling up, Pelipper, why not? Why not? Easy. No six gym yet? No. Wait, did you miss it, Vic? I lost Sa. Like my strongest fucking ground Pokemon. Yeah, I was being dumb. Like, actually dumb, not DOM. I was watching this shit. <laughs> this is why I gotta keep the tab open, man. Crazy shit happens. You trying to beat the six gym? Oh no, I'm not going in. I lost Saw to a random encounter. No, it was a trainer battle. This is why, this is why streamers don't like talking about news. Because everybody's gonna come in the chat asking what happened, what, talk about the news, and it's like you're gonna have to rehash it all again. You know, I had just forgotten that I lost Saw. Like that thought hasn't crossed my mind for like 30 minutes. You guys keep stabbing and reopening the wound. <laughs> Listen, to be fair, what? What? <laughs> what? I was here the entire stream the except the past hour? Oh, well, I lost Saw like three hours ago. It was a horrible loss. 
I, I legit almost cried. I was so mad at myself. I could feel- I could feel the tears coming. Because I'm the type of person to where any type of, like, overwhelming emotion, I will cry. Like, if I'm really mad, I will cry. If I'm really frustrated, I will cry. If I'm really happy, I will cry. <laughs> Wait, I'm confused. I'm running. And then when I'm really, really sad, I will also cry. But that's, like, normal. Okay, it's 4.30 p.m. We got 30 more minutes to level up. Surely I'll get to level a million in 30 minutes. Mm-hmm. Has 69 HP. Yep, mm hmm. Is an emote. Mm hmm. I also would have added a new one. It's Bwaja Jaja. I'm surprised I didn't get a single Bwaja Jaja today. Since I made such a huge L. Popcorn us the entire 80 hours? It's not 80 hours yet. The timer says 78. Don't round up. That's not how speedrunning works. My sister earlier when she was trying to convince me to like end stream so I could play Mafia with her like right now. She was like, can't you just like quit the game? Like if you lose you can just play again. I'm like, no! If I lose I have to start over. She's like, it doesn't matter. I'm like, 70 hours? You think that doesn't matter? So we compromised. So we're gonna play Mafia at 530. Also, so good at level 30. Let's go. So is so cool. See, so has like nine more HP than Pelipper. Apparently, Pelipper is a bad Pokemon. Oh, he bit me. I'm gonna be smart and go heal. I'm- I only have like two potions left. I need to go buy more of the smaller potions. Just so I have them. Why can't I say queer code? <laughs> Wait, what did you say? Oh, the phrase you put was so queer. I guess saying- I guess that's like saying so gay, like that's so gay. That's funny. I think queer- I know some people don't like the word queer, but, you know, I was- You know, I'm 24, almost 25. So like, by the time I was like a teenager, queer wasn't like a bad word anymore. Like, people were putting like, little heart emojis and then queer. So like that- Queer was never used as like a derogative when I was growing up. Like gay was uh, gay was obviously still like a not a nice thing to call somebody. But queer was like whatever. Anyway.
Back to Pokemon. <laughs> I love this game so much. So much. I love the froggy hat. On the character, it's it's a bandana. It's not a hat. <laughs> like, I know they have, like, novelty hats that are shaped like animals, or they have, like, bunny ear hats. And they're cute, but, like, are you really gonna wear them in public? Do you have no shame? Oh, Pepper's confused. I'm running, I'm running. Like, I can understand, like, wanting to tap into your inner child, but, like... People will stare at you if you wear silly stuff like that. Like, obviously, you do you, but I, I can't handle the the stairs. Also, physically walking upstairs is difficult, too. I'll wear anything. Yeah, Koboba's got some, I say wild, like, shirts and sweaters, but I mean wild in a good way. They're like kind of fire. Go Bobo, you should do like fit check videos on TikTok. I, I think people would like it. I'm saying that genuinely. Or what you should also do is do thrifting videos, but then like scalp whatever you get at the thrift store. Because that, that's pretty cool and trendy. Going on TikTok is so hard now. Yeah, they change the algorithm all the time. Like, my TikTok account has been at, like, 35, 3600 for a while. But I don't care. Like, as long as the current audience likes what I do, it's fine. Because you don't gain, like, a super loyal audience on TikTok. Because since it's fast and casual content, like, people aren't going to be too invested in you as a person. As much as they would be if they're following on, like, YouTube or Twitter. And another reason why, like... I have a personal account on TikTok. I don't use it. I still tag it on my Clips account. Like, I've debated whether or not I wanted to post on the personal account, but... It's kind of like... When you post too much about yourself online, especially on TikTok, people will be invested in you for, like, like, seeing you as content, not as a person. Hi, Peason. It's Tony. How are things with you? Battling much? I just won a while back. My Carvana was brilliant. You wait. I'm gonna beat you next time, right? Take care. Did I get a lot of followers when I started out? No. No, I gained like a thousand in a day. Holy moly, an asshole! Take him under Danny's look, an asshole! I'm gonna kill it! Anyway. I did not gain a lot of followers quickly. And that's because... <laughs> on my personal account, I deleted all the videos on my personal account, but the only thing I posted was singing clips. And they were so bad. They were so bad. And then on the Clips account, I didn't upload every day. But once I started uploading every day, I gradually gained followers. And then I had like, I think three to 500 for a while. And then one day I gained like a thousand from one clip. It was wild. And then I've kind of, I gradually, I gained like, I gained like 20 to 50 followers on TikTok a month, but then I also lose that amount. <laughs> so... I'm like, I'm just, I'm, I'm plateaued, I've peaked. But it's because my clips are very much the same. That's why I think my YouTube channel is growing more than my, like, TikTok account. Because they get all the vertical videos that TikTok does, but they also get horizontal videos too. So there's more variety. And also the main channel is doing slightly better. Wait, talking about YouTube, guys, uh, click subscribe, no YouTube video. Watch it later. Watch it later. The main channel has been doing decent, 
Like, I'm getting more unique viewers, which is good. That means the algorithm is actually pushing out my videos. <laughs> I posted a video once, got 800 followers, but then I freaked out and deleted everything. <laughs> Dude, that would scare me too. Like, for a first video? Well, okay, what was the video about? I think we- ANOTHER ABSOL?! What the hell?! Second monitor viewers, look at this, an ABSOL! I'm gonna kill it! I, I do find it kind of off-putting whenever, like, normal people become popular on TikTok. Where it's, like, them just, like... I, I mean, like, normal in the sense of, like, they aren't creative people. Like, they're people who are, like, just filming them, like, cooking. Or filming, filming themselves, like, going out to eat. Or, like, just their kids. Like, just their normal life things. Like, they're not trying to, like, make something, I guess. Like, I always find that weird. It was literally just one of those voiceover trending videos? Dude, that's so cringe! <laughs> that's why I can't do content like that. Like, I don't want to be known as, like, a trend guy. Hey, whoa, whoa, whoa! <laughs> but I'm being honest. Do you guys think I'm cringe type 1? This is a test. I think anybody who wants to like try to be a YouTuber or a streamer is cringe. And I think it stops being cringe whenever... Whenever like they gain an audience. Because then, whenever you have an audience, like, you usually have money, you usually have maybe employees, like, you have an actual reason to do it. And to clarify, I'm cringe, okay? I'm cringe. Like, obviously, like, some of the stuff I do on stream is fake. Like, this is this is not my real voice. Like, my, my cadence on stream is very different than IRL. Like, they do kind of blend together, but on my, like, when I commentate on stream, Wait, I don't- Dude, could I ever do a stream as, like, actually me? I've thought about that. Because, like, me IRL, like, friends know, family know. Like, I'm not super extra. Like, I- I- I can be extra. But, like, on stream, I'm- I'm, like, tryharding. Like, this is me at, like, 200%. I think, like, IRL, I'm a lot softer. I'm not as- I, Like, I'm still curt, but I'm a bit more, like, nice. You- you guys get evil peace. <laughs> this isn't the real you? Yeah, I'm sorry to break the news. Also, your mother and I are getting divorced. I'm sorry. Oh, my Diana. But also, since I've started streaming, my friends have said that I have gotten funnier. Mm hmm They're like, dang, peace Like, you're actually, like... Like, kind of hilarious when you, like... Actually, talk. I'm like, yeah. <laughs> no, one of my friends did ask said that. <laughs> it's because, like, when I was in high school and shit, like, obviously, when you're young, you're still discovering yourself. And I wasn't very confident, and I also didn't, like, talk much. There was a year in middle school where, like, I basically was mute. Like, I only spoke when I was spoken to, but I didn't, like, voluntarily speak. So because of that, like, that still kind of hung with me. Because for the longest time, I thought that, like, nobody wanted to hear me, I guess. Or hear my voice in terms of, like, uh... Not, like, my literal voice, but, like, my opinions, I guess. I, I grew out of that, like, once I hit, like, late middle school or junior high and then high school. I was like, oh, nobody cares. But that always kind of sticks with you. And then once I became an adult, and like, once you're in the real world, like, you get to choose who you hang out with. You get to meet a whole bunch of new people in like, college and work. It's like, 
Nobody cares. They're always too worried about themselves to worry about you, so like, you do you. Nobody truly gives a shit, as long as you don't do like, bad shit. Or... Like, mean things, then it doesn't matter. Why are chat colors different on stream than... Wait, on screen than in the chat box? Like, the shading? Um... Wait, is it actually a different color? Oh, it's because I use a third-party chat box down here. And on Twitch... Oh, for this chat box, I think I used, like, uh, accessibility colors. So there's a bit more contrast. Also, in my own personal Twitch mod view, um, I do high contrast colors too, just so it's easier for me to see against a black screen. So! Grew to level 31, two more levels, and he's ready for the gym. So is trying to learn cosmic power. What is this? Cosmic power, psychic. Raises defense and special defense with the mystic power. Oh, so it's like Ralph's move. Mm. Okay, okay. Raises defense and special defense. Ooh, okay, so that's way better than Harden then. Yeah, that's way better than Harden. Yup, we're switching it out. So, learned cosmic power. I don't think So's gonna learn any more rock moves, guys. I might be cooked. Hmm. Well. So it's genuinely so bad that I lost So uh, It's so bad. I think that's the first time I lost a Pokemon in a trainer battle. Because I've only lost Pokemon to, like, a Brendan. I lost one to Brendan. I lost two in gym battles, and then I think Chat killed two on this run. But to think I lost it to a freaking Surskit. I need to get over it. Bennett Foddy. Hit game. I'll never play those Bennett Foddy games. Or any game that will, like, intentionally make you mad. Because, you know, I want to be a happy person. And with the whole gimmick of the game is to make you mad. They're- the- the devs are literally farming you. You're letting them win if you get mad. Pepper grew to level 31, let's go! We got 10 minutes left. Oh, peace and hi there. This is Maria. So, are you getting more Pokemon together? I'm having a rotten time of it. They'll all get away from me. See you. Tier list of your favorite chatters? No! You guys would hate me. And, okay, I'll tell you who my favorite chatter is. Now, I'll be honest, rarity does affect a chatter score. Yeah, it's, it's gotta be Mr. Batty or Ice Lemon Vanilla. Those are like... Because they're like... They're always funny. They're always funny. And they don't... They also don't overshare. Like, they're, they're usually just here to put emotes, to say little jokes, and to make me giggle. They're like literally the perfect chatter. Okay, okay, I see how it is. No! 
Well, see, I told you guys would get sad. And if you want, like, a, a chatter review, I do it every year for Christmas. I think a YouTube highlight video is called I Got to Write Sa- Oh my god! I, da, 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 da. I forgot! I thought that was Poochiana. Shit. There's a YouTube highlight. It's called I Got to Write Santa's List, and it's basically where I, re where I read Chatter's logs. It's a very fun stream. We do it every Christmas. I mean, we've done it two years, but... This year it'll be three. I've never seen Batty share anything. I know, right? He's just here to, like, giggle. Like, Batty just types bat chest, and I love it. <laughs> So, the less I chat, the higher points I get, basically. Well, if you think about it, the less you chat, like, the less likely you're to say something, like, unhinged. Like, there was one time Vic said, when I pulled up a YouTube video to watch with chat, they were like, Hey, look, that's the fun YouTube video, implying, with an undertone, that all my other YouTube videos are not fun. And that was not cool. All my YouTube videos are great. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Wait, what? That happened. Do you think I would make up a story? I technically do... Okay, I don't make up chat messages. Sometimes I reword them to make them sound better. Peace and lies? Okay, I have to lie. You caught me. Sometimes you gotta lie. Did I have ice cream today? I had a bite. I'm not crossing my fingers. I had a bite. I don't remember this. My bad. No, I'm kidding. It doesn't matter. It's so funny, because new chatters, they'll say like something like, offhandedly rude but not realize it and they're like no please i'm so sorry but then after like a month or two they like they just type lamau <laughs> whenever i roast them it's so funny like i edit old streams for like animal crossing and mario kart for animal crossing i'm like literally two years behind so like i can see like the streams where some of you guys first chatted and i've told this before but like not max logs when when Mac first started watching and chatting, they were so nice! <laughs> Not a single your mom joke in sight. I hate Poochiana. And it's also really funny because, like, Cool Bobo is, like, just as clueless as you were, like, two years ago. Oh my god, Absol! Guys, I'm not lying! Second monitor viewers, click on the stream! Absol! I'm gonna kill it. I've seen so many Absols today, like, genuinely, I thought this was a rare. Easy. Did Potato ever get their painting? Yeah, they did. Well, yeah, they did. <laughs> that was like... Last year in... July, I think I mailed it out. But they did get it. We haven't seen Potato and Chad in a while. Or for a while. Yeah, I remember they were making jokes about the painting tasting good. <laughs> I 
I can't come and I literally stopped chatting for a year. You know why? Like, Twitch has smart notifications for everybody. So when you click the notification for a channel, and... It's kind of like an unwritten rule. If you don't click on the action notification on your phone for like two or three months, it stops giving you notifications. Which makes sense, because like obviously if you're not clicking on it, then you're not like actively engaging with the channel. But then it kind of kills channels. <laughs> yeah, they've had the UI function for like literally like five years. It's just a lot of people don't know about it. Like, it doesn't necessarily, like, reflect negatively on me. It's just, like... Only turn Twitch go live notifications on for a channel if you're genuinely gonna, like, watch the stream. And even better yet, probably just follow your favorite streamer's social media. Because most creators will tweet out whenever they go live, or... Because just in general, like, even for a Twitch go live, it takes, like, an hour or two sometimes for viewers to even get it. It's so stupid. The only thing that's good about YouTube live streaming is that their notifications are banging. Like, you can put on notifications for a YouTube stream. And I will literally get the notification five seconds after the streamer started stream. It's wild. But then, also, for YouTube streams, in order for people to get a notification, you have to, like, pre-schedule your stream. And then... Like, click go live. It, it's so bad. But I, I usually have notifications on for Ludwig. That way I can get in right away. Guys, we only got five minutes left together. And then we'll do calligraphy, of course, but... YouTube Live is like the Dollar General of streaming. I think some of YouTube Live's UI is good. Like, I like how you can go back in the VOD really easily. The player is nicer. The background play is seamless. Oh my god, Absol, guys! Second monitor viewers! Oh my god, Absol! <laughs> Type 1 if you're watching on your first monitor. <laughs> I need to know. But, like, the chat UI on YouTube is still not good. Also, if you're a YouTube member to a channel, you can't use the... Oh, he's taunting me. You can't use the channel emotes in other chat rooms. It's so dumb. I'm watching on my second monitor. Mods get him. Only first monitor chatters here. Lazy King Grudel level 44, let's go! Isn't Descendants the Disney movie? I'm so mad the VOD for the sub only stream wasn't public because I didn't get to see the birthday stream schedule. Yeah, take the L. Take the L. The sub- it was called Secret Stream. Here, you know what, Kobobo? Wait, I lost it. I'm kidding. <laughs> when am I posting the VOD on YouTube? Um, in a month. Mainly because, like, my YouTube channel isn't monetized, so I still get some ad revenue when people watch the actual VODs on Twitch. So, VODs on YouTube usually go up after a month. Yeah, I know. I'm scamming. I'm scamming. What are you gonna do about it? <laughs> Is it a lot of things? Kind of. But you'll just have to find out on April 24th, man. I think I had like uh, five viewers during that part of stream, so five of you guys know. But also, don't narc. If you narc, you get in trouble. So, grew to level 32. One more level till So is ready for the gym. And you know what else I'm ready for? To wrap up for today. So let's save. I know, short peace log stream, short six hours, but I gotta go play video games with my favorite sister. So, let's do a quick save. 53 hours? Oh my god. Game has been saved. Pause my timer.
Omega Dance, 78 hours. Also have to run an ad? Non-subs? Click subscribe. Do it now. Did it run the ad? Yeah, I cried last year on my birthday stream. This is, like, kind of iconic. Oh. Wait, I gotta recap. I only got- I only have 15 minutes, guys. I have to go play video games. Again. <laughs> okay, so let's recap. Wait, I have to- I'm gonna make sure to write my live splits now. Man, another six hours in. Clock in, clock out, everybody. 70, 30, 46.12. Holy. It is the end of Peace Lock Day 12. To recap, after six hours, I, okay, within the six hours, I did spend like an hour or two trying to figure out what flying was weak and strong against, but you know, I figured it out on my own, I didn't look it up, I'm no cheater. I also, I caught seven Pokemon, but I lost Su to a pitifully horrible mistake. I forgot that Sir Skit was water, one hit KO, in a stupid trainer battle too. But you know what? It's fine. I still got two rock Pokemon, so next time we're gonna keep focusing on leveling up Soul and Errand. That is the goal. And then, finally, I will defeat the sixth gym, easy peasy, lemon squeezy. So look forward to that. Also, <laughs> 78 hours, that's almost two full whole work weeks coming up. Guys, do I get overtime for this? Do we tell Big Twitch, do I get overtime? Yeah, that was Peace Lock Day 12, everybody. Oh my god. No shit. It's actually kind of fucked up how, like, contract work is. Because when you when you stream on Twitch or work for Twitch, you're counted as a contract worker. So there's, like, no benefits, no overtime. There's no incentive for you to, like, stream more or less. Besides, like, just getting more sub or bit revenue. So it's, like, actually kind of fucked up. Like, imagine if Twitch paid you, like, a dollar for every hour you stream. Like, that would be more than, like, sub-revenue per hour, you know? Anyway. I'm a small channel, so it don't matter. Guys, we only got, uh, 20 minutes left together. So if you want to spend more time, use your channel points and I'll write your name. Do it now. Do it now. Do we have any stallers in the chat? Thank you for redeeming, Electra. Um, plan is simple. I'm taking tomorrow off. My sister is gonna try bubble tea. And then, uh... And then, Monday, peace lock. I'm- <laughs> Monday, I have to beat the six gym. I have to stop stalling. <laughs> Emerald color? Good one, Kobobo. You know what, guys? Since you're watching till the end, I will spoil what we're doing for the birthday stream. Get ready. Put your ears to the screen. I'm gonna spoil. Are you ready? Your mom. Got him. <laughs> Bazinga. <laughs> Let me actually listen. <laughs> no, for real, Kabobo zones out a lot. It's so funny. Okay, let's pick a song. I found a new compilation. Let's see if it's good. If you want a playlist of all my stream music, here's a link. I have it on my YouTube channel. They're all royalty free. Let's see. This compilation is called Y2K Aesthetic Video Game Songs to Vibe To. Also, while I'm getting the camera set up, if you could, make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channels. Weekly stream highlights on the main, and daily clips on the clips channel. If you want something to watch, watch my newest video. I tried parentheses, I mean quotation mark, drinking and driving in Mario Kart. Watch it now.
Also, my camera is too zoomed in. This is like... You don't need to see this. I also heard a bing. Drinking, but it was a brain freeze. Don't leak! Why are you spoiling the video? What the hell? What the hell? Oh my god, there's two of me. I didn't show feet! No, I'm kidding. You're fine. <laughs> I don't care. It's like, I say it like the first 10 seconds. I can't have alcohol, so I'm having slushies. I say it in like the first 10 seconds, so people can't accuse me of clickbaiting. I'm so scared of the YouTube comments. They're like crazy. I thought it was a secret. <laughs> if it- Okay, I'm putting my hair up. It's bothering me. If it was actually alcohol, I put I would have put alcohol in the thumbnail. I'm surprised I had my hair done all day. I think it's <laughs> to overshare. I didn't like wash up yesterday. Oh, this is ratty as hell. What what happened? Have I ever gotten drunk before? No. I'm like, there's a, I'm like too scared. Cause like, what if either like something bad happens when I'm drunk or I like it too much? Cause like I've seen alcohol like destroy families and I don't want that to happen. Same, yeah, I'm too scared. Like, I don't want to be the type of person who has, like, a glass of wine whenever they get home. Also, alcohol is expensive. You guys think I have money for that? I also can't spend my disability money on alcohol. <laughs> There's a few things you can't spend on. You can't... You can't buy lottery tickets, you can't buy alcohol, you cannot buy weed. Everything else- oh wait, you also can't gamble with your, like, your disability money or your EBT or your government subsidies. Everything else, fair game. Alcohol is so pricey for no reason, and it literally, like, is so cheap to make. Like, guys, restaurants who charge you, like, 30 $40 for a plate of pasta, they're scamming you. It probably costs them, like, a dollar maximum. Maybe $5 if it has a meat in it. And then also, like, the main thing you're paying for whenever you get food, like whether it be like from the grocery store or at a restaurant, you're paying for the laborers. Olive Garden, dude, Olive Garden is so overpriced, but it's so good. <laughs> it's so good. Once again, thank you to Alex for the tier 1 sub. I think this is your first time subscribing. I appreciate you. Thank you. Once again, thank you. Just... Please... Don't gift any more subs to kill the Pokemon. <laughs> please. The people getting gifted continuing to sub? Yeah, that's actually huge. That is huge. That is why, like, I've thought about it. Um, if I ever... Obviously, whenever I'm off of disability benefits, like, I can... Get more money. Like, I can have more revenue streams. So that's like, I can start selling art again. I could enable donations through, like, Streamlabs or Stream Elements, but I thought about it. And, like, when you get donations through third-party services, you have to report them on your taxes differently, and that's, like, a whole... That's a whole can of worms I don't want to tap into. 
And then also, like, when you get a gifted sub, like, that's actually going to a viewer, like, not just to me. You know, I get a cut of the... I get the sub revenue, and also people get emotes for free, and I think that's a huge dub. Mac wanted green because they miss Kim. That's so cute. Wait, is the camera focused? I can't tell. I I hit my camera the other day with the mic. Oh, what is that? Well, that's a blister. <laughs> Dude, I thought I cut my hand. That is focused, okay. Wait, today's Saturday. I'm not gonna have time to try the crumble key lime pie. Oh no! What am I gonna do? Crumble stocks down. At least your bank account will be happy, but yeah. The main reason why I didn't get it is because I have to take a, like a like a 30 to 40 minute bus to get to my closest crumble. So it's like, am I really going to spend 30 minutes there waiting for the bus and then 30 minutes back just to get one cookie? Like, I'm not that obsessed. So like, I only get crumble if I will buy at least two cookies. So that way I can get one for me, one for my sister... And then maybe an extra one if I want it. Because I've been cutting back on sugar and stuff, right, in processed foods. Like, I can still guzzle, like, fast food. Like, it's so good. But the last times I've gotten crumbles since I've started the diet, like, I physically can't eat the whole cookie. Like, it, it's too filling. I can't do it anymore. I used to be able to eat a whole cookie in, like, 30 minutes. But now, the last time I got crumble, it took me, like, three days to eat one cookie. I wonder if they'd give you a free cookie on your birthday. Oh, yeah. Or, I know they'd give you a free cookie, but I don't know if they'd give you a free pie or cake. They probably wouldn't. But since, you know, I tip well and I riz, maybe they'll do it for me. Crumble is low-key overrated. Yeah, it is. It is. I think it's just the novelty of it. I am very much more attracted to the gimmick of a rotating menu than the actual cookie. But I will only get crumble if there's like one or two flavors that I genuinely want to try. I think the best part about crumble is the icing. I love the texture of their icing. I'm um, hashtag not an ad, but crumble, if you want to sponsor me, that would go crazy, but I wouldn't take it because if, <laughs> dude, if I took a crumble sponsor, everybody would call me fucking fat. <laughs> like, I know you guys wouldn't say shit. You'd be like, oh my God, crumble. But, like, if I were to, if I had to do, like, a YouTube or an Instagram sponsor for Crumble, I would get so many fat comments. Like, I, I know I would. You tip at Crumble? Yeah. I, anytime I have cash, I always tip. Like, I got my, uh, disability benefits, and I withdrew, like, uh, $50 in fives. So that way, anytime I go out, I can tip. You carry cash? Yeah, but don't mug me. Don't mug me. <laughs> don't don't mug me. <laughs> I usually carry like a prop phone and a prop wallet. That way if anybody does, you know, come up, I'm not like, oh, take this. Okay, Electra, that looks kind of rough. I'm sorry, I tried. The blue pen was broken. The brush tip is dead. Okay, we got one name left. Guys, I only got five more minutes left with Chad. It's already 5.15, so... Any last redeemers?
Okay, I'm done. Guys, short stream, but also a long stream for a peace and channel. We added six hours to our peace luck run. Next time, I promise. Hands are not crossed. I promise I will beat the six gym. I, I promise. It'll probably take like an hour or two leveling, and then we'll do the battle gym at the very start of stream. But yeah. Guys, thank you for watching any chatter circus. Once again, thank you to Alex Those CX for the tier one sub. I appreciate you. We the tier ones do help a lot. Okay. Plan is simple. I'm taking tomorrow off, so if you miss me, um just watch every single one of my YouTube videos. Like click on the playlist, must watch videos, and watch all of them. <laughs> watch all of them tomorrow. And then Monday, peace lock, day 13. Tuesday, I'm also taking off. I'm gonna go see the new Monkey Man movie. And if you've seen it, um, no spoilers. I want, I want to see it so bad. It looks so good. Also, like ever since like I've been talking about Monkey Man, like just on stream, and then also with my friends, like I've been getting more movie trailer previews. I think they're listening to me. Like I'm being serious. Like on every single social media platform, I'm getting like movie trailer ads. Also, the Civil War movie looks kind of good, like in a cringe way. I don't know. But I'm going to see the Monkey Man movie on Tuesday. So, I will see you guys on Monday and Wednesday for more Peace Lock. Hopefully, dude, my goal is to be Peace Lock by... Wait, I gotta look at a calendar. My goal is to be Peace Lock by... Obviously, by my birthday. <laughs> Realistically, I should beat Peace Lock by April 17th. Hopefully. Because I want to do some other streams before the birthday stream. Because honestly, the 12-hour the stream will take me out for a day or two. Waiting for a 24-hour stream? No, I'm not going to sleep on stream. Whenever anybody asks for a 24-hour stream, they literally just want to watch you sleep. Mods, keep an eye on Cole Bobo. You know, I've been watching for too long. Why do you want a sleeping stream? Just go watch Ammo. Okay. <laughs> Guys, thank you for watching. I'll see you all later. Have a good rest of your night. Enjoy the rest of your weekend. Thank you for choosing to hang out with me on a Saturday. And if you're gonna get turned tonight, be safe. Bye, guys. I'm gonna go play Mafia and eat dinner. Bye, Vic. Just put on Emmy stream when you're tired. <laughs> no, restreaming is bad. Yeah, Emmy streams so late. She usually starts at like 9 or 8. Like, I'm in bed at that point. Like, usually I'll type in chat for like the first 20 minutes and I fall asleep with the stream open. <laughs> I feel bad. But, you know, she's got a real job and shit. You guys are lucky that I don't have a real job. You guys get so much more time with me. Also, Kim should be untimed out. Yeah, Kim is no longer timed out. Okay, I want to make sure I did it right. Imagine I just, like, permanently banned Kim. <laughs> that was the plan all along. <laughs> okay. Final minute. Do you guys have any final last words for me? But seriously, thank you guys for watching. Also, with your patience during the Pokemon streams, I know I'm not the best, I know I'm learning. But thank you guys. Pokemon is not gonna be my main thing. I'm all, I'm only gonna do Pokemon once a year. I, I'm putting my foot down. Only once a year. Because as you as you guys see, it's like a two-month ordeal. Holy fuck. I started Peace Lock March 12th. It's been almost a month. It's mainly because I don't do it every day, but like if I did Peace Lock every day, it would break my brain. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you later. Have a good night. <laughs>